one of the goals. biggest entity artist or duo that pushes on my piano used to be a hip hop uh it's a hip hop outfit major league oh, oh. Yeah. brilliant example ah, but, they'll, 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 enough. Ah, but they'll do anything even if gospel tomorrow was big <laughs> <laughs> But isn't that versatility that's what we want, though? Yeah. The major I'm just ones. saying. <laughs> Go deep, Papa Pass. The major ones. Go deep, Papa Pass. Go deep. Inga. Bamini. This episode is powered to you by Accelerate Fiber. Thanks to them, we have access to super fast internet. And if you're looking to get connected, click the link uh, description below. That thing always dribbles me, man. I can never say it properly. Like, I always try to say, click the description. No, no, click, click the, the link, link on the description, description below. below. Just click the link below, man. Yeah, Just man. Just edit the script. Click the link below. Yeah. But they wonder, where is that link? So it's Below. It's in the on box. The description. The description. Dis- <sighs> Pick the box, my, <laughs> my bebeza. Just click the link below. Edit the script. Click the link below. Yeah, click the link below. Yeah. Uh, and get access to uncapped Wi-Fi, uncapped fiber, and welcome to the uncapped lifestyle. Mm. Uh, we're also coming at you at Mashabela Studios. If you want to use these podcast studios, just email Mashabela. No, it's podcast. Podcast. Wait, wait, wait. It's here, at Mashabela. Yeah, it's podcast, podcast at, at mashabella.co.za. Yeah. Yeah, those are our sponsors for today. I'm done with them, ne? Okay. Ah, yeah. Well done. All right. And now we are back. We are back. Oh, man. So you got to tell us the funny story. There's a funny story you told oh, us. Oh, fuck. Of A. Of A. Oh, yes. You I thought you were going to segue me nicely into the story. You know, like, I thought I was going to say, like, hey, man, you know, one time I had this uh, Yebo Waba girl. So I'm, I'm telling them how Neo is such a hot sister. Like, oh, oh very. What are you going to put uh, Neo's sister in this, though? That's where the story started. Neo's beautiful. <laughs> Neo's sister is beautiful. And you can tell she was raised well. Like, oh. even Neo, you can tell. Like, they're from a good home. No, is she, is she the younger sister or I the tried older? Hoping. Older. You know. older. She seems older. Yeah, Neo's putting his head like his hand on the head. Like, <laughs> no, 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 no. Sorry, Neo's sister. I saw his status. You know where he was like showing his mom, and Neo's never personal. Like he never puts up st- WhatsApp statuses because he knows who he works with. Eh? Yeah. So Mac is like, is she a yabo bob? I'm like, no way. <laughs> she is, but like an educated, smart one. You know okay. what I mean? New school. New school. You yabo bob. Old school yabo bob. I was <laughs> never. <laughs> you know they sexy from afar and keep it at that. Yeah. I once like brought one home who liked me. I liked her, you know. Yeah, well, Baba. How did that conversation start? Even how did you guys even get to talk? she's like Zulu Pakla, like proper. Okay. Kulumi, so I was Kulum. What's so what do you make? Pakla means like hardcore. Hardcore. Oh, Zulu okay. hardcore. Yeah, okay. Like, okay, okay. Pakla. What you found each other? She was going to <laughs> get some no, water she was at by work, the river. At a place of work. Okay. And I liked her, like. This was a while ago, by the way, and I liked her. So obviously we talk, hey, Johnny, Shaw, Grandy, yeah, and your pila. And you can tell she's, uh, you know, like Zulu, hardcore. <laughs> and obviously the day came, D-Day. <laughs> <laughs> or day for the D, rather. She came through, <laughs> and she was home, we're chilling. It happened just at 1 p.m., broad daylight, kissing. 1 p.m.? <laughs> hey, you savage, dog. Yeah. Wait, you don't smash during the day? Nah, dog, the sun is out, dog. <laughs> It's fucking hot as hell. <laughs> yeah, sun is out. When you you only smash it at night. Yeah, dog. Oh, dog. You're nocturnal. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. But continue. Yeah, Baba. Yeah. Yeah, Baba. So we're kissing. So we're kissing. We're kissing. It's nice. It's heated. You know. Mwah, mwah. I'm like, oh, okay. She kissed like this. Okay, cool. That means we're cool. We're good. You know, she's freaky. Gandhi. Obviously, then, you know, get up from the couch. I want to sap, you know, like, obviously, I'm taking you to the bedroom. Uh, get to the bedroom, kiss, 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 kiss. Mm. I start to undress her. She's mm. like, no, I'll undress myself. Okay. <laughs> okay, she likes to be in control. Like, That's just cool. No, but it, it, it didn't even come across as that. It came, it wasn't like, throw me to the, you know, she should have thrown me to the bed and said, don't worry. I got mm. this. Oh. That's kinky, right? Yeah. So the car comes, was cool. I was like, oh. 
okay. <laughs> now I'm there, awkward with a hard on. I'm already naked. You know, I was trying to undress her. She's like, okay, okay. I'm like, I ain't your Well, I'm leaving you with his kulul. That's cool, that's cool, that's cool. And then, as soon as she's done with the bra, I'm like, Mwah. she's like, no, 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 no. <laughs> She goes down. She, now she came with a bag, a small bag, like a, a like a handbag. Yeah. You know? So you think it's a woman? You don't care what's in the handbag, right? Yeah. Maybe like lip stuff or whatever. Co- yes. Now. Guess what? She takes out the handbag. Ini. Itugu. Itugu. <laughs> She's like melatwal. <laughs> Do. She needs to protect like, her hair. Yeah, but I'm like, the only hair that should be covered is my dick. <laughs> With a condom. <laughs> right? And some hot sauce. <laughs> Yay! Hey, dog, certified lover boy. Yay! Hi, cool. Okay, cool. And then guess what she does next? Now, my dick is still hard, and I'm not, I don't know how, right? Because now she's got so many rules. So the dog, she doesn't want her hair to get fucked up. I don't want the hair to get fucked up. Okay. I still on the 30... Oh. This is a girl who's prepared. Yeah, she's How? getting ready for yes. prepared. Yeah. yeah. And I, then I was staying at High Point. I stay on like the 20th floor. It's an wow. apartment. Okay. So my windows, like my curtains are always open because there's no one who can see me. I'm on the 20th floor. Oh. Right? Only God can. Even when I close <laughs> my curtains, God can still see me. Yeah. So I'm not going to close my curtains for God. <laughs> but she was like, close the curtains. Hey. Oh. I'm like, no one's going to see us. <laughs> Oh. Like even people on the plane can't see us. You know what I mean? She's like, close the curtains. I'm getting annoyed. Like, fuck, okay. Cool, I close the curtains. The next thing she does, she opens the duvet. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Uta scum. Hey. Oh. What does that mean? Let's cover up. Yeah. Let's cover Let's up. Let's get inside the blanket. <laughs> <laughs> it's 1 p.m. No wonder you said, get she's up. The sun is out. <laughs> and then, no, Uta I school. understand. Uta school, man. <laughs> That's when my dick fell. Like, <laughs> <laughs> but now the thing is, she's so hot. And as, soon as, as soon as she laid there. Is this now a sister? No. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. No. You said hot. <laughs> as soon as she's there, she's got a hot body. Yeah. Then my dick rises again. <laughs> it died and rose again. Yeah. Now we've got two Mkumenis in the fucking room. <laughs> <laughs> and it was the longest sex I've had, longest missionary, like one position sex. I never do like one position. Yeah. It was the longest. So she asked that it just be one position. Yeah, I couldn't turn her because she was even like bringing the legs to my shoulders was a mission. How? Oh. <laughs> like she wanted us to lay like frogs, like a dead frog on top of another. Like <laughs> as soon as I put like yo, like yo, like geez, what's going on? You're too beautiful and too hot for this. Was she moaning? Yeah, bo baba. Yeah, bo baba. She was not because she was not faking though. She was very silent, like she's obeying me or something, mm. you know, like just disrespectful if she utters a word, mm. like oh. or a moan, or like, mm. Mm, yeah, yes. yes. But I remember, so you didn't hit her with the what's my name? What's my name? Uh-huh. <laughs> 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 she's gonna say, I'm gonna my Timo, nigga, man. <laughs> so I couldn't risk it, you know what I mean? <laughs> it was just, yeah, play safe, yeah. But when we, when I like, she. What I appreciate about her was because she was not faking any moans, when you're hitting it right, then you get the moans out and you know that it's real. Mm. Now, you know what I mean? But it was still like the worst. I, it goes down as one of the worst sex I've ever had. Oh. Yeah. yeah, I never like, uh, obviously she never came back. Yeah. I didn't want her to come back. Yeah. So careful of Yebo Babas. Yebo Babas are hot, beautiful, and they seem like they're stress-free partners from, mm. you know? Yeah, but also taking a Yebo Baba and trying to, Get into a freak and train her. I don't have time for that, man. You know? Yeah. But this was a while ago. So that's the story mm. of the Yebo Baba girl. Yebo Baba. Uh, I love Yebo Babas, man. Wow. So you'd like that? Yeah. Close the curtains, put on headgear. Well, not like that. <laughs> in front of no, the, no, 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 not like that. Underneath the sheets. Nah, 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 nah. <laughs> not like that. But I'm saying in general, I like Yebo Baba. I like them too. I like it if, like, you know, a woman respects me mm. and shows me respect. And, and, and reverence but she must be a, f- a, freak. a freak in bed mm. you know what I mean she you know in, it's the bedroom no one is watching us it's just you and me because as ninjas all we want is just someone to stroke our egos that's it yeah, no? so it's and the ego stroking yeah and Yebo Babas do that very well Yes. Out, yes, but outside the bedroom. I've never seen a dick this big. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> I think all girls 
do that, please. <laughs> like, yo, this is so big. But you are Ampure uh, uh, Yebo Baba, no Coach Lady. Nice. Am I a Yebo Baba? You are Ampure Yebo Baba. You're like a new school Yebo Baba. Yeah, I'm a new school Yebo Baba. I know how to stroke an ego and make you feel like a man and you like the, you're the boss of the house. Yeah. Oh, but real? deep down, I'm, I'm like... I'm in charge. Nah. But, but that's what I will, will. I will. You, you. I will allow him to be, and he is like the 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 head. Women are the always man. in charge. You guys yeah. are, are the head generally. Yeah. You make the decisions and you pull the strings behind. You know. Uh, 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 behind and, the stage. And you see that because you, your man will not be unable to ever make a decision without you. That's when you see that. Oh, okay, I'm very. Powerful. But Yebo Baba is a dying breed because even in like the the, the 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 villages now they have internet, they have Facebook, hey, and everything. Yeah. Like, more Yebo Babas. Hey. Right? True, right? Now you've got breed. village slay queens. You be like, no. Okay. <laughs> Quick question. So when Mnaga, mm-hmm. his family member, calls him, mm-hmm. like, yo, I need. Three grand, five grand, I'm sure of whatever, whatever, whatever. Does he now need to consult you? Yeah. Or are you happy with him coming back and saying, Listen, I gave someone so and so and so, he wanted so and so, I've made a decision, I'm informing you. How how should that go? So normally with our the way we like everything he will tell me. He will just come and tell me and like, okay, so and so asked this. I did it. I yeah. not to say, should I? No, it'll be um, are you cool with it? Oh, yes. so it's a should I? Yes. Huh? But obviously, and I'm always like, no, no, no. With helping, I'm for it. Yes, as long as you're yes. told. Yeah, with helping, I'm for it. But obviously, there's even close family members where if someone calls you and whatever the issue is, you can just tell me later. You don't even have to call me now. Yeah, because it's an emergency. Yes, it's an emergency. Oh, you know, beautiful. then there are some, obviously, like I'm borrowing, please, and that, and that, and that. And then maybe he even wants my advice. Like, should he? What should he say? How should he handle it? You know, especially if it's a message, you'll forward it to me. Like, if Someone has so I'm like okay You're no good just wife. yeah. You're what happens? Wife. What happens uh, during the honeymoon phase with you guys, man? Because during the honeymoon phase, bro, a woman will do everything, bro. She'll suck your dick like three times a day. <laughs> <laughs> She'll make your bed. No, no, She'll no. Cook. We, should, we should ask you what do you guys do because you are doing the most exactly oh. during that honeymoon phase, and that's what you do. Then you start showing also your. Behind. Nah, you're lying. So you're saying it's us men who trigger the sloppiness and the comfortability yes, in women. I always say, I always say, you know what? The thing is, you, you men always want to make it like as if it's the woman. No, it's you. No, Ghosty, wow. you're a lying. Woman, a woman always reacts to what a man is doing. Nah, nah, fuck out of here. Seriously. You seriously. know what happens, so? I get it. Before you were calling t- like and you were 10 times flowers. a day. Then you start changing. Sending now it's flowers. once a day. You never send flowers. Only when I fucked up. You see, that's the problem. <laughs> what do you, do? you must send flowers when there's no, no problem. Hmm? Yeah, here's what happens. Let me mm-hmm. let me break it down for you. Yeah. Three months, they'll do anything yeah. to get the prize. And the prize is being the main chick. Suck the balls. Suck the balls. They'll do everything. Oh, Whatever damn. you want. You know oh, what I mean? Damn. That's the time to do all the freaky shit you want to do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> they won't test you. Yeah. We'll just play with the testies. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Drop that you know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah. And then uh, after three, six months, I don't know long. I don't know how long usual uh, the, 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 honeymoon the honeymoon phase. phase. How is how long is it? Well, it differs per couple. Yeah. yeah. Some people, yeah, it can. Last but not longer than six months. No, then you're pushing it. Okay. Yeah. Right. And then once they know they're the main chick, ah, yeah. uh, they start being comfortable, dog. They start being comfortable. When you dick suck, they're like, I hey, suck your own dick. <laughs> <laughs> but it's not long enough. <laughs> <laughs> now the truth comes out. <laughs> yeah. When you ask them to do the better, like, hey, do I look like your mother? Yeah? <laughs> you know what I mean? I'm telling you. True colors come out. Because your true colors also came the out. Color come out. <laughs> <laughs> Now you're ordering takeaways. They can't make pop anymore. <laughs> <laughs> am I like? Am I like? Eh, 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 ah, that's eh, true. That's true. Too tough for sick. I got But also, <laughs> but let's be real, man. But also, guys, we slack as well. Exactly. After the whole, because. I'm a guy who buys flowers, sends flowers. Oh, listen to this fucker. He's playing to the female chillers. Can you see? <laughs> but I, I do that <laughs> also, I so do I that. do that also. I'll get you flowers, chocolate. What do you like? Sunflowers? Trust me, they'll arrive at work. I love Before you flowers. smashed or after you Before. smashed? Before. Okay. You see? Before. Yeah. And then you get the prize. And then you, and get, then the you price. get the cookie. Uh-huh. That's when I know I'm really like super in love. When I still continue even after. Right, but generally we also slack. Yes. Everybody slacks, dog. Yes. You take out. You get you comfy. Have two evenings out every week. You know when it's still new, and then we stop. 
everybody just gets comfortable when they've secured the position. Mm-hmm. So according to you, what changes from honeymoon phase to now? Hey, it's a man. Because it's downhill <laughs> from, from honeymoon phase, it's downhill. Nothing's ever nice after honeymoon phase. But the good relationships stay like that. It may not be at that level, you know, of, 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 of intensity, the, the sending of flowers, the emojis, you know, the hearts and everything, but it stays like that sometimes. Hey, out of the blue head, now you and your big forehead. You fell in love with the other ir- the, you did something irritating. Like, yeah. What do you think happens? Where's the where's the change? You just get too familiar to a person. You know, like the things that intrigued you about them before you actually knew them. So it's like, but now maybe let's say, you know, at MacIver love the way you laugh. Yeah. Next minute now your laugh is irritating. Ah, you're too loud. You understand? During honeymoon phase, do you fart? Ah, uh, yes. You fart? Do Thank you. you. Yes, phase. please do it. Yes. <laughs> Most fart. Yes, please. fart. fart. Ah, I prefer yes. that. Like, I'm ah, one of those guys. I get real. Too, yeah. Like, I get too comfortable too soon. Yeah. And I prefer that. Like, don't close a door when you take a dump and you're at my place. Yeah. You know what I mean? Because we are planning... And you get to a certain stage where you're dating to get married to a person. Mm-hmm. So let's just get these things out of the way now. Yeah. You know what I mean? L- let's see how bad it smells, you know? No, like, it's like your own dump. It really smells, but you can stand it because it's from you. Yeah. You know what I mean? So if I love her, I love everything, even the stuff that comes out of her. Ish. And if, as bad as it smells, I still love it. So get comfortable. <laughs> Do all those things. Let's get it out of the way. So don't... Do the thing of we're going out and then you don't order everything that you want to order. Mm. Order! If you're walking, be a panga, do it! <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? After all, I like for you thick. I know where the thick thickness comes eat. from. Exactly. You eat. Exactly. Exactly. Yeah. You know what I mean? So the problem sometimes is that you're acting too fake in the first three months. To impress the That person. when you start eating, when you start opening the door while you, you're shitting, when you start farting and that's it's what like, women do women do oh my that. god you're like this yeah oh, do it from the get go get go and I, I, I do that like if you come to my house first time but we're ninjas dog we always do that we're always up front we've got no time to be fake but women ah, but you portray like an image for well. three minutes but oh. niggas like to be fake also yes like you don't e- expose the extent of your untidiness when mm. she comes yes. tidy up tidy up hey, put so the condom under the, the pillow everything is ready for mm-hmm. action yeah even money you're using your savings that day yes time. even money even money <laughs> You know what I mean? Like, make sure that everything is needed. Like, you know what I mean? Like, full chicken Nando's, 800 rands, fine. Maybe you, hide, you know what I mean? You even hide you, the main No, chicks. like, this is like when you're home. When no, you're I'm home, saying, when you're going, eating. During honeymoon phase, we're going to Jameli, dog. After okay. honeymoon phase, like, I eat Jameli. I am a sim. I am a 2,000 rand again. I am a sim. You said you could like a Scop. Exactly. Now you see, you How much she gives you head, you're like, yeah, scop. <laughs> Let's all get head. <laughs> but you're right. So I think it's both ways, man. We all fuck up after like a while. And yeah. the really good ones, relationships, they, the honeymoon phase, it dies and then it's still there. But it's like I said, the less intensity. But the appreciation of love is still there. Mm. The trick is That's to, when you know. The trick is to always rekindle those things and always do those things. That way it stays that relationship. Yes, thank you. That's it stays true. on that point. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. Nyan, nyan. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's right though. But yeah. like, you know what I mean? So it, it won't be like weekly or whatever, but always do those nice things. Always rock a surprise, Nyana. Mm-hmm. Rock a little present. Rock a little... Send her a dress. Mm. You know, but like, but like tonight we're going, ah, oh, send her a dress. A dress. Send her a dress. Dog, you're romantic. Look, Yo, look, not you're that romantic. I like women mm. in you're dresses. So I'll buy a dress. I'll buy a woman a dress so it fits her tightly, nicely, just for my enjoyment. Yeah. Yeah. So you send her a dress, you send her flowers. What else do you send? Location. Where are we going tonight? Ah, fuck. Yeah. So so is a playboy, eh? And later send her to cloud nine. (laughs) 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 I'm not a playboy, man. Yeah. But dude, when you're in love with a woman, it inspires the right things out of a guy. That's why... A guy can treat one woman so differently from all the other women he's had. Because when you're with the right person, that comes out naturally. And then don't you feel like when you fuck up, you're out of cards now? Because you can't send a dress again. You can't send flowers again. What do you do when you fuck up? Just be honest. Tell her I fucked up. I'm sorry. But you don't send anything? Nah, don't. 
Yeah, it depends on the level of the fuck up. Also, mm. Ooh, yeah. yes. yes, yeah, of yeah. course. Sometimes you don't, because you know you fucked up, mm. and she knows what you're trying to do. So just be honest. I fucked up. Whatever. Yeah, and, whatever. and apologize. And, and, and yeah, let's shit simmer and down. And then obviously using those things that you know that make her happy, and just to yeah, you know, yeah. Get do, you, do you guys believe the Drake story? The Drake story. Yeah, that's a is weird it true story. though? I didn't see it from a credible source, but I, it's been making the it's rounds. It's been making the rounds, like on and on and on. Yeah. Yo, you guys believe it though? <laughs> Just explain that for those who don't know the Drake story. What happened? So, um, Drake story. Chick complained that Drake Instagram girl Instagram not a, not girl just any oh chick. by the way Drake smashes that I yeah. believe so that's believable because Drake generally I mean he smashed uh, Zamina Zamina O Z M E E N A underscore O R R mm. thank me later gentlemen <laughs> that's the Twitter and the Instagram yeah. Zamina O right? so he's, he's he's smashing these he Instagram he smashes Drake his baby mama was baby an OnlyFans mama. woman yeah. Yeah. you know what I mean yeah. he smashes big ass and he's much he's also smashed i believe cherokee i just have need to f- i've never proven it but he had because one time i was doing an interview cherokee is a porn star cherokee ds and someone asked her about her and he laughed because and they follow one another ah smashed, smashed so drake smashes porn star mm. only fans chicks mm. thick instagram chicks you know what i mean like if drake was south african He'd be running after a table mm. or a um, faith, a faith in kids, yeah. or a a a a, a Rasiko pumpkins. Oh, and yeah. you like who are the Instagram girls? Valley, you like some thick. You know what I say? Those the, the pumpkins. The ones that um, Sol is mentioning. <laughs> what blue? Okay, bombo? I'm gonna just mention. I'm just gonna mention the super thick ones. Yeah, there's, but that's the problem. Blue is and there's very so many thin, of them was th- skinny. Uh, Bloom Bombo. So she's an Instagram man. She's classified as an Instagram man. Does she act? What is? I last saw on Disky Diva. Yeah, she was on Disky Diva. That's my introduction to her. Yeah, so she, she, she was on like Big a Brother as well. Big Brother, yeah. No, 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 that's brown. Oh, that's blue. Yeah, blue was on Big Brother. Yes, yes and Soccer Wives, whatever. Yes. Disky Diva. I'm talking about brown. Brown is a thick one. Sorry, man. Thick <laughs> <laughs> like, I forgot blue even exists. <laughs> and they're twins, right? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Flip. Sorry about that. <laughs> yeah, but like, so Drake. Was with this no, hand. you still haven't told me who are the Instagram miners. Is there only five? <laughs> it's tough for me to tell. I'll, I'll give you the thick ones. Okay, give me the thick ones. <laughs> Rosicho Pumpkins. The ones mm-hmm. you follow. Yeah, that's Rosicho Chabadira, real name. Obviously, um, Faith. Um, there's uh, Penelope Shongwe. Mm. Jesus. Jesus. <laughs> You don't know Penelope Shongwe? Mm. Let me search. Cool. She sounds fire. Penelope. Biggest Penelope. bomb in South Africa. Man. Penelope. Penelope. Yeah, Penelope. Mm. One of the celebrities was, was smashing there. Eh? I just can't for, seem to remember now. Penelope Shongwe. Yeah. What's her name on? She's on Instagram, hun. Oh, it says Penelope Shongwe Instagram. <laughs> yeah. Ah, oh, see. oh, yes. I'm on her Instagram. Whoa! Oh, damn! Whoa! damn! Whoa! <laughs> and I know Ayers. That's Ayers Ellie. That's down Ayers Ellie. It's like whoa, nah, bro. This ain't no roadkill. <laughs> no, this that's not roadkill. Mm. That is 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 is. Ooh. How do you get a bum this big, bro? And it's that's a beautiful South Africa. She stays in Pumalang. Sure. Yo, you even know she stays. <laughs> What's your address, Sol? Hmm? <laughs> where the sun rises. If she, if she gets up before the sun, it's a solar eclipse. <laughs> <laughs> I saw it. Yo. Can you teach us? There's also Yolanda. It's Yolanda, Yolanda N. Yeah. Yolanda N? Okay. Yolanda. Yolanda N. Uh, let me. Yolanda. Yolanda underscore N. Yolanda. Put two A's in y- Y. O L A A N, oh man! Let me just get her thingy. So, so the problem is, so this might not be an accurate, but these are also Instagram. Okay, but Yolanda's a teacher. Hey, even Penelope is a teacher. It's so weird. Go ahead. The, Penelope is a teacher by yeah. profession. Yeah, she's a teacher. Uh. Even Yolanda is a teacher. Uh. Yolanda, it's Y O L. Y O L, yes. A A N. A A N, yes. Underscore N. A A N underscore N. Okay. 
Oh, <laughs> damn. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. My goodness gracious. And then there's obviously the obvious ones. Hey, Instagram is nice, nah. Instagram is really dope. So do you just DM these girls and then they give you the fee? No, 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 no. I just, they DM me, I block them. <laughs> <laughs> and you remember, oh, is that why you remember them so well? Even no, their location. Like, well, well, once, once someone's inbox, they didn't inbox them, but like some do, but like, no, I remember them well because of, you know, they are what I like. I just don't like it being on Instagram and I like a, a girl like that. Hey, this is too much. As but she's got person. like one follower on Instagram or three followers. You know mm. what I mean? I dig that. Because when it starts to get into 50,000, 60,000 and all the pictures are like showing their bodies, somehow that just doesn't engage me. You know? But anyway, yeah, back to Drake. Yeah, Back to Drake. So mm. one of these girls, she okay. likes them thick, really thick bums. And he, they hook up, they smash. Obviously, it's Drake. He straps up because he's Drake. You yeah. know, you need to condomize. He doesn't want a second born. Stra- straps, smashes, smashes, smashes. And then he goes to throw away the condom. Yes. Yeah. Goes to the bathroom. And he puts hot sauce. Yeah. Now, I don't know why Drake has got hot sauce in the bathroom. Puts hot sauce in the condom. Apparently, that kills the semen. It mm. kills the sperms. In Does fact. it? Apparently. Because isn't it like with uh, uh, um, uh, with the sperm, hmm? the moment it becomes exposed to the air or whatever, it yeah, dies. It, it yeah. dies. Yes, yes, true. Yeah, that's why we but pull we pull out. Ah, but <laughs> how many? That's not why we pull out. How many people are out there? That's not why, why we pull out. Why result of a pull out? But you're right. It doesn't live long outside of the human body because of the temperature and everything else. It dies. It dies, but I think it it, it takes us a a while. Like, not a while, but there's a a, a window. Okay, let me check how long that window is. How long does sperm stay alive outside the human body? Okay, how long? Yeah. Because remember, we donate sperms at the sperm bank. But they put it in the thing that's a controlled temperature. And then straight into the fridge. True. Mm. But Google. <laughs> it also likes warm environments. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, uh, outside the body, sperm can live for about fifteen to thirty minutes. Yeah, we in go. the right conditions. In the right conditions, yeah, go, go, right? Go. Or a regular room temperature. Okay, mm. so yeah. this girl had about fifteen thirty minutes to get yes. Drake's baby. Yeah, So okay. it's a weird story. So I saw there's so many like holes in the story. Cause now then he. I don't know why. Okay, you're in the bathroom, Drake. Why don't you just flush the condom? Mm. That's what I do. But he doesn't flush it. He he throws it puts in the bin. It in the bin. Mm. Yeah, you but know what I mean. Obviously, he did something clever. Already put hot sauce in there. But before even that, that girl obviously after the condom was thrown away from that story, she now put it. She took the semen from that condom and obviously was trying to insert get, it insert inside, inside, inside of her. Of yeah. Her. So she yes. went to the bin. And that's the thing, women do and that. And that's how she figured that it was, she started burning. That's then what she wa- wa- realized, yeah. But I'm saying, is that a thing? Like, women do that? Um, that's a it's the first time I hear that. If you're rich enough, they'll try to trap yeah. you by all means. That's yes. crazy. If they're rich enough, they'll try to trap you by all means. So she's taking the sperm out, putting it in a... Yeah, putting it inside of herself and that's hoping the sperm is still alive to swim. Now, hot sauce is red or orange. Oof. Condoms. Oof. Could be red or orange. Oof. I mean, there's r- orange condoms, yeah. there's red condoms these days. Flavored so condoms. that's the only way she could have not noticed that there was hot sauce inside of. And she thing. described his dick, eh? Apparently, it's seven inches and it's thick. Yeah, apparently, apparently. No ways, no ways. Well, but every guy who likes thick bums should be able to handle thick bums. No, but seven inches, dog. That's massive, bro. Seven inches. What is it in centimeters? Google it. It's probably like sixteen centimeters. Ah, those small free rulers were 15 centimeters. <laughs> hey, that's, hey, hey. Yeah, yeah that's inches. decent. Yeah. That's Do you have a ruler here? No. No, we don't You're have the stationary. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, at 17 centimeters. 17, yeah, yeah. exactly. 17 centimeters. Massive. Wow. Yeah, that's long. That's massive. Wow. That's long. Yeah. Wow. If the story is real, because I didn't see a credible, I just saw an Instagram post, but it did the rounds. So and then she was suing. This, well, the story at the end says that she's suing Drake. That's stupid. She's why are you going sure. to people? Why are you going to a trash can to find something to insert inside your you body? Know? And then you sue. Like, you know, if Drake is seventeen, how big is Basta? 
Because there's some niggas that you can just see. Pasta Rhymes. Pasta Rhymes? Yeah, there's niggas that you can see. Ah, these what niggas the packing. What the fuck is this, man? Pasta <laughs> Rhymes? Pasta wow. Rhymes, dog. Pasta Rhymes? You can see Pasta's packing, dog. No, I ah. can't. Ah, you're lying. Ah, come. You're lying. Hey, Jeez, you're Jeez, so look at niggas and you be like, so you size them out, hey? <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Let's be honest Ooh, now. Okay, nice. okay let's, let's be really honest in this room. <laughs> so... So when you thought about me, right? Do you think, <laughs> do you think I was packing? Because clearly Max sits there, there like, and goes, hey, nice meeting you, you like, at, YFM, at YFM in 2010 in the Y Academy. Hey, nice meeting you at MacGyver. I'm sore. Did you go home and think? <laughs> Firm handshake. Thick hands. Mm, so Got a nice dick. <laughs> this piece is hanging. <laughs> He's like, he's like, what the fuck, bro? And then I'm you're like, on to Aya. You be like, Aya, you've got soft hands. Small hands. Uh, is not, is but that small not? hands. Nah. Aya's got soft hands. No, guys, don't lie. There's small niggas hands. you can got see. Nose ring, like. There's niggas you can see. There's niggas <laughs> packing, bro. You can tell. There's niggas packing. No, I've never Bro, thought. your manager's packing. I can tell you that. Ha. Spiso's, you can see. Spiso's packing, bro. No. <laughs> well, it will be easy yeah, to Spiso prove. Spiso is packing. Yeah, it will be easy see. to prove just to see his stuff, you know, his work is out there. <laughs> uh, <laughs> hey, that's weird, man. I, so, I've just never looked at pasta and thought, <laughs> hey, that's niggas packing a big dick. <laughs> Mechi, which other South African men are packing? Oh, yeah. yeah, who else do you think uh, yeah. is packing? Give bro. me names. Give me names and I'll tell you. Um, uh, 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 uh. Hey, no flavor. Th- ah, come on. <laughs> I said guys. Oh, <laughs> fucking hell. Wow. Real men. <laughs> All right. <laughs> wow. <laughs> uh, you know else? Uh, the guy we interviewed, Via Dabula. Yeah, he looks like he's packing. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. They have a they have a look about them, dog. Ah. The, the, the way they move, dog. <laughs> <laughs> These niggas are packing, bro. But you see, you've Pasta is a guy Pasta Rams is a gym guy. Vutabu is a gym guy. So but so not every all gym, gym guys guy. are packing. So, so gym every gym guy you feel like Yeah, Nux is not packing. You can see Nux not packing. <laughs> Nux not packing. <laughs> 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 hey man, we might go head to toe, <laughs> neck and neck. Give him names, guys. Yeah, um, give names. Mm. <sighs> um, Prince KB, yes. Oh, oh, come on, well, we see, but you could see. I, I knew before. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Hurry, I knew. Hi, uh, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. Um, my police. Ah no, lightweight. Lightweight. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Um Pasta 99. No, I, no. I don't. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a say you never know. Let's say You never know. You never know. They're not a circus. <laughs> they come, then they packing real shit. Yeah. Um uh 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 Hey man, who else? I can't think of guys like because yeah. I'm not interested in who's got a big dick or small dick, you know? <laughs> like <laughs> Fuck. But anyway, yeah. <laughs> yeah was Continue. Funny. Yeah. <laughs> no, that's the story. So she told it. Mm. So the chick is suing Drake because uh, she got burnt by hot sauce and her pussy because mm. she was trying to trap Drake yeah. to have kids by Drake. Hey, bro, we got to move to America. I hadn't watched like a podcast in a long, long time. Yeah. So I decided to watch this podcast last night in America. Yeah. Within five minutes, dog, they're like, hey, that girl's a dirty whore. She's <laughs> like, hey, I'm, I'm a friend to slap that bitch. <laughs> wow. I'm like, fuck, imagine. We can't even say it. Imagine we <laughs> say that. Move so you can say that. Yeah, I'm saying we must move to America, <laughs> dog. Imagine we say that shit. <laughs> no, would, uh, no, no, it'll be over for us. Hey, just the word like whore. Whore. Sure. Hey. You can't refer to anyone as a whore. Hey, and then you're like, I'm a finna slap that bitch. You, you can't use I'm, you can't refer a to a woman to as a bitch. I'm a finna. Oh, I'm finna slap that bitch. Oh, I wanna yeah. oh. They were like, I'll beat that bitch up. Sure. <laughs> what? I'll beat her up. No. Hey, there's no Jimmy V that's like no. Damn. Wow. I'm like, if you say that in then say it's like hey, you know they love the word climate. In the climate of the country. Oh, the country. Cli- yeah. oh, we've heard that a lot. <laughs> yeah. Climate. With this climate. You're blind, you're deaf to the climate. Yeah. <laughs> you're blind to the climate. Your deaf tone. Oh, you yeah, know. I'm a climate. <laughs> uh, heard. They were off. like, don't look down. <laughs> 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 we gotta go to America, man. Yeah. Speaking about dicks, did you hear about the guy who uh, his dick shrunk because he took the vaccine? 
Oh. It shrunk by 1.5. Let me get the story. <laughs> you should have taken the taken the Pfizer vaccine. Man claims he has lost 1.5 inches 1. from 5? the length of his penis. 1.5. Yeah. 1.5 inches. Oh. So what's that? Two and a half it's centimeters. Like a finger, or three a finger long. You know, maybe let's say oh. Shit. No way. Yeah. That nah. Is, that is. But sad, maybe gained weight. Maybe. <laughs> No, but no, no so No, because weight they does say make your dick seem smaller Seem, I don't know if you've measured it but don't Seem, like when I'm Lost weight, when I'm like 90 kilos And I'm, that's a skinny me My dick looks longer mm. When you are bigger You know it Because obviously now It's like your body grows into your dick Sure So, it, so it not, maybe there's maybe other reasons Not the vaccine Because of the stomach now Maybe I can see my dick. No, but I'm just saying because of the stomach when you're standing and then you're thinking that it's shorter. Can't you know? It's just that the stomach no, is already I, I just covering. No, I can see. I can tell. Like, oh, okay. There's a thing. Hey. You know, you can feel and tell and... No, man. I get what you mean, but no, it's not correct. You okay. can tell and feel. What's the average size of a dick? What's the average size? I don't know. Uh, let's Google that. <laughs> It's just a dick show. Welcome to Dick and Chill. <laughs> dick and economics, yeah. Average dick size. Sorry. Like hey, man, size. what's going on, bro? Why are we talking about dicks? Average penis size. 5.1 inches. That's 5.1 inches is how many centimeters? Damn, that's like 12. Damn, So amongst bro. the guys here in nah, the show. Google dick size. Average dick size in America. Why are you Africa. stopping me now? <laughs> that average size has been brought down by America, Europeans, and white people. B- Google in Africa, because that, that's like 10 centimeters, bro. That's tiny. 12. It's 12 centimeters. That's tiny. Yeah, it is. Because yeah. that rose free rulers are like 15 centimeters. They're like this. Yeah? Average. 15. So, I. In Africa. Then you're left with nothing. Hey, can you watch the average? <laughs> Wait, can you? Can you watch the. I've never seen. What's the average? But you still can't tell us in I centimeters. can't tell because it's not like... Oh I'm, my goodness, I, they've got this in countries. Congo is big. Congo is Ecuador like... Ecuador is 17 centimeters. That's the average dick. Oh. Ecuador. Yeah, Ecuador. 17. Cameroon is 16. <laughs> <laughs> this is wild. <laughs> Let's see South Africa. <laughs> hey, South Africa, dog. <laughs> I told you that weight thing, you know. Mkabi, <laughs> mkaba. Yes, kubaza. <laughs> oh wow! Ah, South Africa is ten, dog. Ah, what? That's our average, yeah. Damn. Uh, Brazil is fifteen. That's pathetic. Zimbabwe is fifteen. South Africa is yeah, ten. Yeah, I've heard Zim guys, and yeah, I've heard girls who've been with Zim guys that yeah. Senegal is fifteen. Ivory Coast is fifteen. We are ten, guys. Ten. Ten. Oh, Nigeria fourteen. Wow. Nah, that's not big. Fourteen is. Above average. Hong Kong 11. <laughs> oh, wait, Chinese. Wait, Chinese got bigger dicks than us. Wow. Wow. Yo. Sure. Okay, not me, but generally, guys, you see team of it. Yo. Can I ask you, even though you're married? Can I ask you, even though you're you married? Huh? The biggest dick you've ever seen. Can I ask you, even though you're married? Yeah, well, I've seen pornography as well. Oh, okay, it's cool. Yes. No, he's you see, means like, in real life. In real life. In real life. Yeah, yeah. No, no, I don't I know. I can't ask I, you, ne? You can't ask me. Well, if it was now, you would have answered. Bro. <laughs> <laughs> so, that's a, that's, that's an answer within I've a no seen. answer. They're just like, I can't tell you that. It's, on, it's only nuggets I've seen, please. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Hey, this one. Uh, cool. <laughs> hey, did you check, uh, what's his name? Uh, Pogba dancing to I'm a piano. Oh, that's dope. Yeah. That's a song I wish had a, had a, had a challenge. That, that it's, it's Amino. Yeah. You want a bamba? Yeah, yeah. You don't guys know the song. Um, you know, no, 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 no. Yes. Pogba is packing, you can tell. Ah, of course. Yeah. I mean, it's from where? Um, Mali, I think. Senegal, Mali, Congo. Somewhere, somewhere there. there. Yeah. Mm-hmm. yeah. Even Lukaku. Lukaku. Yeah, you can, you can tell. It's holding you see what back. I'm saying? When he's trying to. <laughs> that's how I have a pace. <laughs> <laughs> the shit is holding him back. Have you seen Lukaku? He runs like he's wearing Timberland. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah so shout out, man. Yeah. My piano, bro. My piano is so global. Pogba was just, and he literally, 
the caption was, you want to bamba. Mm. That was dope, bro. I love that, man. Shout out to my Apparently piano. Apparently, Bonang also commented on that. Oh, this is yes, oh, Bonang, I think did she? she's, mm, mm. she's She's eyeing on Pogba. Mm. Yeah, so she and sees what you see. country, by the way. Yeah, she's back. Uh, is she going back to the States? Hey, oh, we no never idea. know. Hey, hey, sh- we never know. Bonang, hey. hey. We never know. But I, I don't understand how, like, as an artist in SA, you, how you could hate on a piano, bro. For me, it's like the I new, it's the new. Uh, uh, um, Who still does though? Afro beats. Who still does hate on a piano? <laughs> there's there's, there's, there's hip hop cast that will never touch it. Like nasty would never touch it, ne? Yeah, yeah weirdly. Nasty. I can't, we can't speak on his behalf, but it doesn't seem like he would. No, he said. Oh, he said. He said he will he never do it. a piano track. Oh damn! For real? For real. Which is so puzzling, dog. That's wow. like, it's like the new Afro beats, like, yeah. it's our thing. It's just the sound. It doesn't change who you are. <sighs> if you're a rapper, like, if, if as long as you find the right Dude, beat, Sakodi is a hard just, rapper. Yeah. And he climbs on, you know, Ghanaian exactly. Afro beats or whatever. You yeah. know what I mean? It's not always boom bap, like, to Hey, correct me. Uh, yeah, most of these piano guys now were hip hop. Like, Young Stunner used to yeah, be. Young oh, yeah, Young Stunner. That's why they're so, so good true. at writing. Young Stunner is good at writing. Because it was, was hip hop. Yes. The trail was hip hop. Even the contemporary guy, Chico. Yeah, Chico. Oh, Chico. Was yeah, he's yeah. dropping oh. bars. He's dropping like, what do they call them? Um, what's the that Spitori style? style. No, Bacardi. what's that style? What's that style? Yabo, Kanye West and. Um, trap. 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 Oh, he's dropping yeah. a trap style oh, okay. on piano beats. You see? Ooh. That's and what that's what makes them dope. Yeah, because they can write reason, yeah. reason as so, well. Yeah. Uh, yeah. You know what I mean? It's sliding on those beats. Thank yeah. you. Yeah. Like it's you sleeping on something huge. If you think, even house guys, I don't get them. Like why they hate I'm a piano? Isn't I'm a piano dance music? Isn't house all electronic it's, dance it's music? All it's dance the same music. thing. Yeah. I'm a piano comes from house. Yeah. So why wouldn't you embrace it? And it's a South African style that is uniquely South African. It's the weirdest thing. Yet there's Pogba there in Manchester you know? embracing yeah. it. It's the weirdest thing. And that's the only way we can export it if everyone embraces it. And One of the goes. biggest entity, artist, or duo that pushes on my piano used to be a hip hop. Uh, it's a hip hop outfit. Major League. Oh, oh. Yeah. brilliant example. Ah, they but they'll, 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 enough. Ah, but they'll do anything, even if Gospel Tomorrow was big. <laughs> <laughs> but isn't that versatility that's what we want, though? Yeah. The major I'm just ones. saying. <laughs> <laughs> Go deep, Papa Pass. The major ones. Go deep, Papa Pass. Go deep. <laughs> <laughs> With that double anointing, eh? <laughs> double, double anointing. I <laughs> bet <laughs> 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 the league would do anything, though. Yeah, but, yeah, but, 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 it, but being that still. versatile, is that, 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 isn't that what we're fighting yeah, for? Yeah, and embracing though. the South African sound. They'll do anything I... I get it. I'm a rabella, sure. But <laughs> they they embrace a South African sound. And look at them. How many millions have they made from Mama? P- They're getting sued by SARS, dog. For real. And not sued, I mean. But SARS wants their money. They owe SARS millions. No, that's Major League Gardens. That's not... It's got nothing to do with You think youth. that's events? Yeah. That's gigging. Ah, events. Okay, how much do you think they made from a Major League Garden event? Three mil, four mil, five mil. Three mil, four mil, sharp. How much do you think they charge per gig? Now, yeah, They're probably on 30k. Thanks to my piano, how many gigs do they have a weekend? I don't know, I'm not fucking following me. Oh, fuck. <laughs> they, they're doing major league balkan in Ghana, bro. We were in Ghana, did we get paid? Did we gig? <laughs> <laughs> what <are> we gigging? <laughs> Only got to play one song, yeah. bro. Yeah, that's something. <laughs> You want gigging? Dog, Durban Coco gets 17 gigs. Yeah. Or 10, let's say. Comes at a small 10. Those guys are charging 40K, 30K, 300K. Allegedly, say allegedly. No, know. they post a gig guide. It's not alleged. They don't post how much they charge. Oh, come on. But comes at the, the small didn't show up in PE. And the guy was like, I want, he wants his 40K back. Yeah, but what is that? That was like a but, friend, friend. But let's be honest, dog. Major League is making millions from them up here. Oh, yeah. No, no, I'm not disputing that. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. No, so are. Well, that's what I'm saying. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like, they're mm. making a killing, mm. and they were smart enough to hop onto the sound, and everybody else should take advantage of the sound. Oh, yeah. I For me, if you're good at mm. making music and you make my piano today, and let's say my piano dies, and tomorrow you make a house song, I'm not going to say, oh, you're just jumping back and forth between two fields. No. Is the music good? It's good. Sharp. And it's not going to die anytime soon because it's a generational thing. And so now, the 2000s, when they start having kids, then there'll be a new sound. Yeah. And now the sound is changing. I mean, have you seen, like, guys are experimenting. Gubs are the small from, 
I'm sure Vumbali or whatever to Asbe Two different sounds. Two different sounds. What's, whose song did you play now before we started the show? Melo and Sleazy. Melo and Sleazy, new song. What's yeah. it called? What's Bacardi. The they do Bacardi house. Ilendo. Uh, Ilendo. Yeah. They do Bacardi piano. Yeah. yeah. Check yeah. Ilendo. Crazy. But it's got African, like, it's got drums, like congas yo, yo, and those bongos. Those guys are crazy. Mm. Right? Mm. Melon Sleazy. Yeah. Um, uh, 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 Sleazy and Measley, you mean? <laughs> yeah, yes. Oh, yes. <laughs> What's his name? How could I forget? Yeah. What's his name? <laughs> um, the boy that I like, man, who does Africa Rising? Uh, Vigo D. Vigo D. Ooh, now, oh, c- can you hear? That album is tough. So, I'm a piano's not gonna die anytime soon because yeah. the guys are that diverse. Have you heard Vigo D? Africa's Rising. Yes. You. Yes. We will rise. Oh! <laughs> the break. <laughs> we will rise. It's like a movie. Yay! You feel the bass vibrating. Like, Ooh. One man. We will. No feature. No feature. The whole album. One man. We will rise. No, no, no. He has some features in the album. But oh, does he? Yeah, yeah he does. Oh, okay, but generally, but, yeah, one man, one man. <laughs> <laughs> so Forget the sound the is features. diversifying so much, bro. Yeah, I love it. It's no longer that. You know, there was a, a time where it was just like same sound. Sure. You mm. know that pad they use, goo goo goo. I'm not talking about ooh, yeah, whoa, 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 whoa. It was just that. Now yeah. it's like crazy. So you're right. It it's these kids and it's young kids, bro. Mm. Oh, Melon's leaves are like 1920, yeah. bro. Yeah. Damn. Coming with fire, I love it, man. I saw this guy on um, on Twitter. Someone sent me this, right? Yeah. I don't know. I, I'm alleged. Okay. I don't know what he does, okay. but I think he's like a new school sangom. So he's a he's a sangom. <laughs> like no, his handle is at twenty twenty two Africa. Okay, no, that's not the sangom. Yeah, that I'm thinking about. So he made predictions for the year twenty twenty two. He has oh, some wow. of his predictions, right? Oh, damn. Okay. He said someone gonna try kill the Zulu king. Oh snap! The truth about the Moti brothers will come out. Moti. Moti brothers. Do you, you know, know the brothers that got moved kidnapped? Out. They've actually oh, left the, the Moti, the, yeah, the, the Indian Dubai. family. They went Dubai. No, the yeah. family relocated now. Yeah. Oh, it's so. Oh, that uh, rich Indian family, yeah. 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 So wow. he says the truth about that will come out. Okay. okay. He says university coming under fire for protecting rapist lecture. Wonder what that is. Okay. That's he said Citelo will go to Mac G podcast and share things. Who's that? Oh, Andy Limpisana's uh, baby mama. Oh. Yes, oh, yeah. Andy Limpisana's yeah. baby mama. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. he says she will come. Oh, oh, nice. damn. Ah, we we waiting. We waiting. Come. Yo, uh, we yo, stand oh, over here. Please, we're here. <laughs> let's make this prediction. You know, yeah, succeed, man. Tell us all. Yeah. He says a lot of people's relationships we know from the timeline will end. That's that always happens. Yeah, yeah. generally. Okay. Generally, here's part two. Unati will also go to Mac G podcast. Oh, no. Unati, you're welcome here. Yes. Yeah, yeah. Yes. This oh, is nice. this is. Fuck! I love the way it's a good avenue speak, to <laughs> express your feelings. And <laughs> yeah, good avenue. yeah, avenue. Yay! <laughs> <laughs> she used to do a show with Glenzito. Yeah, oh, avenue. Yeah. On the avenue. <laughs> 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 ah, you knew that. You knew that <laughs> 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 yeah, mama. <laughs> ah, let's go. Uh, fuck! Have you heard the way she speaks, bro? Unati's hot. Yeah. Oh, Let's not get it twisted, man. Unati, and it's not just because of that video. And she looks hot even. Right Unati's now. hot. She's yeah. always had, she's older than me, but she's always had sex appeal. She's hot from day one. Unati's hot, period. Bro, as a broadcaster, I, I you know, you always have to enunciate. Yes. Uh, which is what I struggle with, right? Yes, yes, yes. I love the way she speaks, the way she enunciates. Like, oof. She's an orator. She's oh. good. Unati's good. Yeah. No one yeah. takes ah, her. Ah, mesh made it! it! Yeah, 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 Are you wearing those sneakers that I like? You're late. <laughs> hey, nah, Mr. Off White. Hey, dog. Did you, you pay him late? Like 14k sneakers. Hey. Dude, did you walk here? Hey. <laughs> He's wearing 40k if sneakers. If you buy 14k sneakers, they better fly you to the studio. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's got like they sneakers are that are 14k, K, like the off whites. Oh, dog, you gotta start paying tax then, dog. Oh. <laughs> 14 Is it 40 or 14 One four. One That's four. still a lot It's a lot Yeah like for, I'm like whoa A sneaker Mesh Mesh was off white sneakers I like 14k I'm like Mesh These are 14 And it's like Yeah yeah The other pay is still coming <laughs> <laughs> I see Jamal I have an iPhone 13 yeah, that's an iPhone. Yeah. Uh, 13, yeah. Uh, idols will make a decision to bring back some easy. I could see that happening. Yeah, I could see that happening. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. I don't yeah. watch idols, but I can see the, the numbers probably have plummeted since he left. Because he True. was a vibe, some easy. Some easy is a vibe. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, I think they're going to let him in. Like, so I think by the back door somehow. 
What? <laughs> you did it on purpose, so You did it on purpose, you. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> this thing always throws me to the dogs. Wow. He drops one, I laugh, wow. and then I'll train. Exactly. Uh? You train. <laughs> you look at G. It'll be like G on Twitter. <laughs> It's not so. Sol, it's never you. Yeah, it's never so. It's never so. Fuck you. Wow. Uh, 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 this guy he gives me a rope to hang myself. Yes. Every show. And it's always it's always that Mac Mac G Mac G. Wait, man, I'm lost. And then I'm like, but I saw so he so made this thing happen. Bro, bro, Mesh, doesn't so say worse things than I do? But I always train, bro. Yeah. Always. He, me, he mesmerizes them with a pants. <laughs> wow. He makes them laugh. Wow. Wow. What did the Sangoma say? <laughs> Let's go back to the Sangoma, man. Uh, all right. Aries and Blackie interaction. Uh, I don't know what that means. Oh. Maybe they'll do a track together. Are they what? Are they not in speaking terms? No, I think they are. Oh, I yeah. It's not like there's a beef there, right? No, I doubt it. Aries doesn't talk to anyone. Of course. That's oh, the thing. Yeah. So like okay. when he comes out to say hi to someone, it's like an event. Yeah. So I get that. I'm still waiting for a track from Aries, Blackie, Nasty, The Big Hash, and Techo. Oof. Ooh. Techo man, techo. yo Techo, where's Techo man? That's a talented guy right where's there. Where's Techo? Man. Big Hash also. Techo. Oh flip, I remember. <laughs> I remember Big Hash tweeting, "2020, I'm making my comeback" or something like that. And then Rashid from the Hip Hop Awards says, "You're 21 and you're making a comeback." <laughs> <laughs> and Big Hash Wait. was like, "You're too old for this." <laughs> <laughs> Big Hash, what happened to Big Hash, man? <laughs> Bro, how's Rashid? He's crazy, ne? Rashid is a nice guy. And they got a podcast. I forgot it now. I forgot the podcast. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I love oh, that man. podcast, man. Yeah, where well, they chop up things, hip hop. And it's a straight talk. I always say, you know, straight shit. I respect right? Rashid. Yeah, I respect How Rashid. did you first meet him? Oh, I first met Rashid when I was a rapper in Foslo. Mm. And he came from Sprite to come rap in Foslo. But not rap like he was performing. He was just at a cipher. And Rashid would be one of those guys who'd wear the baggiest pants, the most expensive fubu. That's how old I am. All these big <laughs> brands. And that's Rashid, how I met Rashid, literally. Oh. Why like, does he speak like that? Oh, yeah, even his rap, he raps like that. Oh, okay. Like, he raps, like, yeah. Very, like, he's a, he's a fountain of, of, of hip-hop knowledge and everything. You know, not the most dopest rapper, but a, a very good mind. Mm. It's just how he speaks. It's just his voice. It's how he is. So what does he do? He just does SA Hip Hop Awards or Skeeto Show? No, no, he works very close. Yeah, so he does the uh, hip hop thing that happens on Oskito Show's Rap oh. Activity Jam on Metro FM. Yeah. And then he also um, is part of the Ritual Group. That's Osmic's uh, a, a company that does a ritual stores, hip hop museum, ah. SA Hip Hop Awards, and most importantly, the biggest festival, hip hop festival in Africa. Oh, yes. uh, back to the city. Back to the city so he's yes. part of that group doing those oh. things, pushing the culture forward. And he's That's been around, Rashid. man. No, he's still around. No, I'm saying he's been around for like years. Rashid has been around, yeah, man. He was part of, um, well, friends of like, uh, what's that group? Togoza's finest. He was not in the group, but friends of. Mm. He's from Togoza. He's been around the hip-hop game for a Shit. while, man. Yeah. All right. That's Rashid. Okay. All right, so, and then uh, he goes on to say, Uncle Waffles fighting DJs. Ah, that's obvious. Fighting with DJs. That's obvious. DJs don't like her. She's hot. It's like she's got a cheat code. She wears a G-string. Good looking. She sells because sex sells. Mm. That's obvious. You can, anyone can preempt that. She's taking that. their gigs. Mm. Yeah. And it's not even that stupid. That's like the whole narrative of, hey, hey, so-and-so are taking our jobs. But mm. did you apply for them? Do you have those? Right? Because if you're not booked, you're not booked. Is and she, she's just isn't she the highest bookings. booked female DJ right nah, now? Nah, nah, she nah. has Devin Coco is right. Oh, Devin. Devin Coco. Devin Coco is one of the most booked DJs in the period. Devin Can Gogo. you imagine Devin Coco in a G string? <laughs> <laughs> Why are you laughing? How are you laughing? Yeah, I I can't. Can't. <laughs> How? Why are you laughing? I just saw something I'm laughing. Ah. <laughs> no, I can. I can. I said, Those old beamers. Also, that <laughs> guy is not a sangoma. Ha. That guy is not a sangoma. 2022 is not a sangoma. Sorry, what? 2022 is not a sangoma. Oh, it's not a sangoma. Yeah, this guy. Yeah, yeah. Oh, it's just oh. predictions. Yeah, it's just predictions. Oh, but, oh okay. Shit. I oh. interact with him a lot on Twitter. Oh, okay. Yeah. Oh, oh, damn. Yeah. Dope. All right. Okay. Does she have any predictions? This guy, does he have any other predictions for no, Uncle Waffles? Uh, Maybe she'll accept the half a million that was offered to her. 
What half a million? Oh, yeah, huh? she was offered half a million and she declined though. Half a million for what? Half. So you know what happens in this like with these rich men? Oi. So with this underworld of your money's money's moneyed men, they offered she they were she was offered basically pushes the highest. She's like the most famous girl. Everyone just wants to like like literally sleep with her. Mm. And then Okay. I get yeah, that. Offered her half a million and she declined. Someone wait, offered wait, wait, wait. Uncle Waffles. Yes. Half a million. Yes. Smash and apparently this is actually a Nigerian man. Yeah. Hey. Half a million? Yes, half a and million. And she said no? And she said no. What? I feel like it's a good thing. How many times a woman, no, how many times a woman, how many times a woman are just offered money, just like that, and they accept? Half a million to half smash? Half a million to smash. How hard is this girl? I've never seen Uncle yeah. Waffles. So no, no, no. It's like your hockey club here. vibes. I've never seen her like live, live. Oh, like in ball, you isn't, know isn't, her face. Isn't she oh. like 20? <laughs> I was She's saying, young. What kind of cap? What, what, cap, <laughs> what level of capping is this, man? <laughs> She's oh. a young girl. She's a young girl. Because she's in a committed relationship, if I'm not. Like, that's the rumor that is I, you know. And also, I mean, how much around. is he charging? So, I'm sure she's made half a mil by now. I'm, I don't think she's charging 10K, no, 20K. No, 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 no. So, obviously, this guy K, was just maybe? trying to smash. That's huh? it. This guy was just trying to smash. Half a million. Yeah. Mm-hmm. It's still a lot of money. Mm-hmm. But it's weird. It's a hockey I feel club like kind of vibes. You know, these P- rich oh, men. Oh, because she's the hottest girl right yeah. now. Yeah. So, yeah. Oh. So, and it's also, those kind of things, like... From what it was, how it was laid out to me. Yeah. Would you say no to half a million, ghost lady? Would I say no? Yeah. <sighs> if Buster Rhymes came with his big dick. Buster Rhymes? Who cares for Buster Rhymes? I'll say no. <laughs> Buster. Are you convinced? Yeah, you're, you're stuck <laughs> you're with Buster Rhymes. Dick, eh? <laughs> Yo. So he was breaking the neck from the pussy. <laughs> <laughs> stomach, stomach, chest, chest, Yo. breast, breast, neck. <laughs> Good win, Stan. Basta Rhymes. You still remember Basta Rhymes. Like, it took me back, guys. (laughs) (laughs) You know what? I feel like, shout out to her for rejecting it. Yeah. But also, has she accepted it? I wouldn't blame her. I'd still say shout out to her. I don't know if that makes sense, you know? It's money. At the end of the day, but she doesn't need it because she already makes that much. Yeah, you know what I mean. Because yeah. how many girls are giving the pussy for free, free, free? Mm. free. That's free. the thing. Mm. So if a guy comes to her and says five hundred thousand rands and it can actually do some good in your life, shout out to you for taking it. I'm not gonna judge that. Mm. Also, so let's be honest. Mm. Let's be real mm. for a second. Mm. Exactly. <laughs> so that's why a lot of women are. This nigga just... plays for the gallery. Yeah? <laughs> <laughs> I'm not playing for the fucking. Ah! These are my honest thoughts. <laughs> But you said why wouldn't why why would I be against the selling of pussy? No, but you gotta choose one I'm side. I'm a manager in a strip club. Uh, no, but you gotta be one side. You you no. said, you, you, you you agree to both to sides. Let me tell sides. you no. I'm you saying able to please both. Yes. Ah, uh-uh, hold on, right? I'm saying shout out to her for rejecting it. Yeah. Because she doesn't need the money. She's yeah. Uncle Waffles. She's yeah. making so much. And if that story broke, that Uncle Waffles fucked the guy for half a million rands, yeah. guess what? Her career is over. Exactly. Right? Mm. But at the same time, if she was not Uncle Waffles and I was told that a girl slept with a guy for half a million, I'd be like, oh, dope. Yeah, That's I'm half a this. bar. Right? That's some but money what, what that you, could make a difference in her life. But what do you really feel deep down? Choose one. What I really feel is that a woman can sell her body if she wants to. Because nah. already she's getting smashed for free. <laughs> <laughs> already she's getting smashed for free. Why is there a price on smashing, though? In Why? the first place. Because there's a, a, a demand and there's a supply. Mm. Right? Men want pussy mm-hmm. and they can't get it all the time for free. That's why there's a price. It's that simple. It's the oldest profession for a reason. Mm. Simple economics, supply and demand. Men are horny. They want to get inside of someone. And not everybody wants men to get inside of them. So some, some will sell. Ha- some will have to offer money yeah. to get them. And that's not playing to the gallery or being or pussyfooting or being on the fence. Shout out to her for upholding her principles because she can afford it. But shout out to her if she took it. Yeah, it's like, it's like <laughs> yeah. Shout out to her if she took it, and she was not Uncle Waffles. Yeah. If she was Uncle Waffles, and she took it, I'll say she fucked up because mm. she could have made half a million. Yeah, in the next few months, for she's sure. probably for halfway sure. there. For sure, from the gigs. Yeah, yeah. let's be honest, guys. From the skill, from her talent. Yeah, you yeah. don't always have to be on one side. Yeah, you know what I mean. Like I understand with people who sell their bodies, and also there's a whole. Hey, we can get. A, the rabbit hole goes deeper with For people real? who sell their bodies. Yeah, because yeah, like half the time, people who sell their bodies have went through trauma. 
mm. half the time. Exactly. They've gone through like an uncle raping them, Eesh. a dad raping them, a brother raping them. And also with a lot of rape victims, it happens more than once. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. Even boys who get molested, it happens. So mm. by the time you're 18, 19, you need a family that um, there's no money, there's nothing to eat, and already you find men revolting mm. because or mm. you've got you've got certain traumas. Mm. You know, talk to girls who saw their bodies. A lot yeah. of times, there's certain traumas. Mm. It's not just girls who grow up in wholesome families. Sure, yeah. who, it's trauma. It's trauma. That and generally with humans, there's a lot of in. us who carry around a lot of trauma. Yeah. You know, we may not be selling bodies, we may not, but a lot of people... No, there's no human, bro, who's perfect. Even yeah. men who buy sex, also, it's, they come from a place of traumas. And yes. No, yeah. just you grew up without a dad. No. I grew up with like... Hey, where, where, where's my dad coming into this now? <laughs> my dad don't get no I'm, That's I'm why you're busy sizing up everyone's penis. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. Hey, oh, fuck. Oh, shit. Yeah. yeah. He didn't have that moment when he walked in and his father was in the bath. Right? You've all had that moment. Yeah. You're like, oh, damn. Dad is packing. <laughs> and you always say that because you're five. Yeah. And you think blood on yours is packing. <laughs> he didn't have that moment. No wonder you, you no. all just bust the ride. <laughs> and goes, mm. Mm. <laughs> break your neck, come on, Howdy break well your neck, well <laughs> uh, <laughs> mm. and he thinks, mm. 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 and you're like, mm. 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 it sounds like he's minging and he's got a long thing, like, he's coming, mm. 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 no wonder this niggas is measures up their dicks. <laughs> <laughs> no, but I was saying, dog, like trauma. You know, there are subtle things like growing up without a dad. That's trauma, That's bro. Trauma. It's a crazy trauma. Yeah. You know, and it manifests itself. You it know, like in life. Oh, exactly. I disagree, dog. Everybody, I, no, I grew up without a dad. I got no trauma, dog. You think you, you don't? Think you, don't. <laughs> you think you, you think, don't? Bro, we all carry trauma on yeah. earth about some reason. But sometimes you're too short. Sometimes your dick is too. <laughs> sometimes your dick is too small. Sometimes you're too dark. You've been teased about it. Mm. Sometimes you grow up without a dad, you grow up without a mom. We all have, sometimes you're abused, sometimes you're verbally abused, sometimes you're bullied as a kid. Yeah. And you don't know that trauma plays that no, role in your I'm, life. What, your what I'm saying is, I never had a father. Yeah. So I don't know what it feels like to have a father. So I just grew up with a mother and that's my norm. That's my reality. Hey, bro. Okay. If you grew up with a father, do you think you'd be <laughs> the very same Mac G at this moment sitting here with your ideas of the world and how yeah. the world is and how women are and how men are. I, th I think I would have treated women better. Thank you. Because I had no father figure to tell to me, okay, you. this is how you, I had to learn. And that one small so, thing. So the thing that you teach your son now, yeah. it's what you, you're probably do, doing it from a place of, I was never taught this by a dad, so I have to play the role that I never got. Mm. So you see the the place of, instead of working from a yeah, space of, Yeah, but don't make it seem I like saw. I'm crazy and I got trauma. <laughs> and no, it's subtle. <laughs> ah, it's subtle. And that's it's a right, problem. Right, <laughs> dude, dude. Guys, bring one, on the couch. You just said <laughs> your view on women, that one small oh, thing, thing would even change the woman you chose to settle with. Or... It would change a lot. A yeah. small, small thing. thing. Yeah. Well, of because my mom can't teach me how to treat women. No one can. Exactly. Thank you. There's some things that your father must just teach you. Yes. you see, in and fact, no you one can. see from like a dad. Yeah. Mm. No one no one can. Or a male figure, a responsible male figure in your life. That's trauma. Yeah. This is why I'm so fucked up. Nah. Yeah. All of us have trauma, bro. All of us. Yeah. Mm. It may not be absent fathers, but something. All of us. No human grows to become an adult. And affected by the world yeah. and the traumas of the world i did you imposing these traumas you are saying i have a trauma i'm telling you i don't you you think you, you think don't. you don't you <laughs> just yeah. admitted yeah. you just admitted to one like you're no, not a maybe murderer I do. yes <laughs> no but that's after you guys drilling into me i mean obviously if you're gonna <laughs> nah you got trauma we all have trauma Shit, i got it then <laughs> <laughs> Look, bottom line, we all have traumas and we can't judge people for their decisions based mm. on those traumas. Yeah. You know what I mean? Unless their decisions are to kill someone or, or, or do something ludicrous to someone or hurt someone. Then, yeah, of course, you know, justice needs to... But Because I, I, I learned how to deal with women from Tupac. Uh, Listen yeah. to that. Listen There's a video where he's like... Uh, I hope I can find the video. Where he's like... Um, 
niggas need to go back to the OG penitentiary days and start jacking off. Because if we don't, we're going to end up killing each other. We're going to all die. We got to start saying, fuck these bitches, man. If you're chilling with a cool female, that's all good. If you're chilling with a bitch, you need to break her ass and shake her ass. <sighs> So I was like, alright, this one's a bitch. Let me shake and break. I love Tupac, oh. but that was bad advice. That but but that's what I was. And he loves Tupac. Bad uh, I live for Tupac. You remember that video? Yeah, yeah, that yeah, was yeah. bad advice. He knows all the Tupac but, lyrics. So that's but when Tupac I learned, okay, not all loved. women are bitches. Like, mm. there are women that are like, Mm. Uh, that's, what you that's, your ba ba. that's your truth. <laughs> uh, you can wi wife material. Wife material. Yes. And then there's women that are just for the streets. Okay. So I learned that via like hip hop. Okay. And, you know. and I found it difficult. Like see, that, that lesson I never got. Like I, I, I got burnt by women who are for the streets. You know, because I saw the woman, the good woman in her, oh, but see, I didn't see. Oh, okay. Her. Oh. You see, so that's you see my you know my dad should have told me that some girls are for the streets. Some. Are good people, you know what I mean? And those who are for the streets, it's not by their choice. It's traumas. Sometimes, like I said, you know, they grow up maybe without a father. Choices as well. True, mm. but we make our choices based off of our experiences a yeah. lot of times. Yeah, a lot of a times. A lot of times. You know yeah. what I mean? So. Wall of traumas, man. How do we go from Uncle Waffles to tra trauma? <laughs> That's the beauty of the podcast, That's right? the beauty of the podcast. <laughs> no, no, you know yeah. how? Because I said there's no problem she took the money or there's no problem she didn't take the money. Those are still good decisions, but okay. you've got to understand both of them and then we've and got both to the sides. We started to, like, of dissecting. Selling pussy. All right, cool. Last one okay. that this guy said. Prediction. Oh, yeah. But then this doesn't work because he, so he's just making this shit up? How did he get I to these predictions? I don't know, dog. I don't know. But, but they're nice the predictions, one. man. They're nice I like predictions. Them. What's the last okay, one? for the sake of the podcast, it's a sangwam. Okay. It only makes sense. Nah. Nah. <laughs> He's not a sangwam. Nah. <laughs> but it's fine. Okay. We're in it's the fine. list already. The, the last one list. is Eno getting arrested. Eno, the Tebukota Vajane City Girls. Eno, Murulong. The one who just was trending now, now. Yeah. Beating up another girl. Yes. Oh. Eno. No, she, she yes. should be arrested. If that whole story is true, she should be arrested. It looks fake, though. That story of her beating up her friend. No, it's not, bro. Nah. No, 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 no. Did you Don't see the you pictures? Say that. All that ah, blood. Ah, oh. ah. And that Please, can like you make Soul Trend? He said you know story is fake. <laughs> <laughs> you know story is fake. I can tell you that now. No way. No that way. That makeup looks fake. No. Wow. That blood. She had no teeth. On the, ha, uh, she had teeth all covered in the red makeup stuff. No, they broke off the teeth. Yeah, no they broke way. off. No way. Ah, yeah, so. That story. Okay. That, Did the cloak press charges? Ah, uh, we don't know. We heard that there's, a, there's an abuse. I want to see Eno in court then, either today, Monday, or tomorrow, this week. And if she goes to court, are you going to believe it then? Then I'll know the story is real. It's real. Eno's all, what does Eno do for a living? What does she do? Cause She's she always trending for the things. We don't know what she does, and there's people who just want to trend. Doesn't she host? She's a host. I know she's a host, but, but also nobody with this knows whole story, she's a host. It's, it's, it's like, it's alleged that she was pimping. This girl was supposed to... She was supposed to go into a hotel to be with someone or whoever, and the then oldie. she refused, and that's how this beat down happened. You know, she spent the money or the booking so money. It's all alleged. Oh, she spent the booking money. Now she can't return it. <laughs> Jesus. So I don't know how legit what? this. Like, oh, it just the story behind oh. it. There's like, why is what pimps do, right? Damn. Don't yeah, show up so and smack you around. But why is the girl refusing? Because if she went there, she knew what's up. <laughs> She's you, breaching you the see. contract. She may have accepted the money and refused the guy. That's a thing sometimes. Was it Buster One of the girls I mentioned. The of the one of the girls I mentioned from Instagram. They told me they were like, I was chatting. I don't know if I, I'll show you after the show. And they were like, one time, a prominent influencer, not Instagram girl, said, "There is this amount of money. There's a guy in Ghana who wants to smash." Mm. Mm -hmm. She said no. She told me she refused. Mm. I don't know if she did or did not. So it's a thing. It's a thing. Yeah. Mm. Whereby, you know, okay, maybe not, you know, I don't know, you know, story. Yeah. Mm. And I didn't mention names of the pimps, but the girls have a connection of guys. Sure. And the guys are like, yo, I want that one. Yeah. So they'll send yeah. like a catalog. It's an whatever. agency. Yes. Oh. Perfect. Mm. Perfect. And yeah. So. Pussy agency. Pussy agents. Damn. Pimping, basically. Pimps are agents yeah, as well. Yeah, you know. yeah. And you get your commission. And you get your commission. <laughs> <laughs> oh. So, yeah, that story sounds believable, but just the way it was done, the acting, her, it seems so acted out. So, you saw the video? 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. Of her getting the beat up. Yeah, that Musa Kaula guy always posts these things. Yeah, I He's saw. like the new film Pella. Yeah, not a beat down, but her laying on the floor. And the, yeah, I saw like the image. This fake blood here and everything else. Uh, I saw. And no. she says some, some stuff. There's no way that's fake. Is that fake, that bro? Looked, that looked dramatized to me. To me. And if it didn't, then it's fine. It still looked dramatized to me, right? Not everything is as it seems. Mm. So, come fault me for that. Damn. Especially when last week Ino was trending with some other girl. The other week she was trending. It's like, why is Ino trending every week? Because mm. she wants to trend and she loves trending. Mm. I don't know what kind of currency it is, how she monetizes it. Only she knows, but that's what it seems like to me. Mm, I get you. Man. So, it's, yeah. It's like this, this, I don't know. What is this? Is it like prostitution has gone onto Instagram? Is it becoming a whole Instagram thing now? For the longest time. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. For the longest time. You yeah. turn on so Instagram. It just sounds very. You turn on Instagram, you see ass. I bet you. <laughs> I bet you if I open my Instagram right now. Yeah. I'll see ass. And what do you do? Do do you DM these girls and bid? No, I don't. I don't bid. I don't do that stuff. You don't. You don't you offer know. any money, so. No, I don't. I don't What's the no. highest you've offered? Guys, guys, I'm on Instagram. I don't do these things like bid. No, I'm not talking about you. I'm saying in general, right? Yeah. You've got an Instagram. This girl is clearly advertising because she's just posting. She's her selling. Bumps. She's selling. Mm. So what do you do? Do you DM and say I want? Do you offer, like, is there see? an amount of see? figures that you... Yes. See? Ass all over Instagram. Let's see the DMs. My DMs? Yes. Yes. My DMs don't have anything. Let's oh, see. Oh, let's see. Okay, <laughs> <laughs> let's see. Oh, no, no. Hey, uh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so okay. why are you deleting? So I'm not deleting. No, my my DMs are innocent. So so there's an underworld. Mm-hmm. Now nah, my DMs are innocent of girls pimping themselves on Instagram. That's yeah. what you're saying. Yeah. How do you bid? That's what I'm saying. Like, when does the transaction happen? Do you DM? I what do happens? Not, bro, I'd be lying if I, I said that. I do not know. But surely you DM and say, okay, I want you. I think you can. And do then that. she says five thousand. Mm. And then you're like, all right, let's meet at a hotel. A lot yeah. of times, you see, a lot of times, if it was like that, those girls wouldn't be on Instagram. They'd be, I don't know, in a brothel somewhere because that's so upfront. So I think a lot of times it's maybe like a guy would would be like inbox. Because you know first that every guy is inboxing this girl. Sure. She's got a bump. Sure. She's got 100,000 followers. Yeah. Yeah. Right? Yeah. So your inbox needs to look different. Yes. You know, like, hey, what's your account number? Mm. You know what I mean? Mm. Oh, 6'2", whatever, 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 whatever. Choy is cash. You open up the conversation. Ah. So what these girls do on, 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 on OnlyFans? They scam people on OnlyFans. You know that? Yes, they mm. scam people. Because they'll post a video on, on Twitter and say, log on to my OnlyFans. Um, this video is there. You get to OnlyFans, the video is not there. On OnlyFans, you need to inbox. Mm. Then pay, then get the video. Mm. So it's that, I think it's that kind of thing. Mm. But it's something in the inboxes. Yeah, definitely. Uh. Otherwise, why would she be selling yeah. you know, her body like that? Uh. Hey, Instagram's wild. Yeah, dude. it makes just it's social media so It's a unsafe. crazy world, man. And I still don't even get it fully. Mm. You know, it's just the, the chats I have with some girls, you know what I mean? And I'm like, wow, that happens? Like, whoa, that's crazy, man. You know what I mean? But for wow. me, like I said, I, I never have interest because it's like, well, you're already. Sh- it's like that trending pussy that was trending. There was a trending pussy. There's yeah, there was a trending pussy. pussy. A e- pussy trending. E- P. You don't know E P. Huh? You don't know E P. What's that? Like e P. Like where is it? Because nobody could find it, but it was there. Yeah. So this girl had a very like um beautiful pussy. Someone sent it to me. Um, beautiful pussy. Apparently, well, it is actually. <laughs> it's good looking. <laughs> yeah. yeah. So I was getting to that point of. To me, it's like that. You know, I'm not interested, boys. Like, if everybody has seen your goods, then, and that's this is my preference, mm-hmm. right? It's not. I'm saying I'm not shaming women who decide to put everything out there. It's my preference. Mm. I'm not interested. It's like, okay, everybody has seen this thing. <laughs> then why should I be interested in this yeah. thing, right? Yeah. yeah, man. So I'm trying to find it, bro. Hey, Twitter as well. I'll There's show a pussy you. Trending on Twitter. Yeah. It was trending. Uh, uh, like so, a picture of a pussy. Yeah. Now I don't know. What's if so different about it, guys? Though, like, doesn't pussy look like pussy? Just I'll show you what's okay. different about it. Yes. Let me just, just try just find it. Let's see. Oh. 
It's Ooh. in my inbox, man. Me, oh say, yeah, here it is. Oh, no, no. Let me see. Oh. Ah, you know it, obviously. I as a toilet. Ah, oh, we wow. still have those toilets. Ah, but let's be honest, pussy doesn't no. look nice, guys. Ay, ay, ay. Ah, it doesn't. Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't see. Feels nice, but eh? <laughs> yes. So I said, I was like, well, if it looks sure. good, it doesn't mean him, you boy. True. I, I'm from that school as well. Of what? That pussy is pussy. Yeah, but it doesn't look nice though. General pussy oh, doesn't look nice. One. Generally, is, pussies is look nice. Is this the ugly. same one? Yeah, same one. Oh. Oh, yeah? man. Sis, man. <laughs> but you're here talking about dick, like, so happily. <laughs> and hey, this don't look nice this. also. Let's be real. Like, we need what? to investigate this. You know? This don't look good also. <laughs> Wait, man. <laughs> hey, now it's, it's... Actually, we need to investigate. He's saying you now. In the show, 30 we minutes. Need to investigate. Hey. <laughs> 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 We need to invest in game. It's time, it's time for some announcements. Cause, lady, what do you want to say, man? Man, we need to invest in game. There is no announcement. There's Jeez. no announcements. <laughs> Anything else you want to say? Let's open Duka. The lady got caught to store four million. Oh, yes, did finally. you see that? But to what? Finally. Mlangin. Oh wow! You say finally, like it's a, like it's a nice thing. For her to get caught? Yeah. Hi, well, it is. I mean, it's justice, Hi, right? Guys. But deep down, didn't you wish, like, she could get away with the money? Because it's insured. Someone will pay it off. Yeah. Is this but the... Ooh, which girl? Crime is, is crime, guys. Uh, okay, you're right, though. At yeah. the same time, I'm conflicted, right? Yeah. At the same time. Because, because, you t- because you'd like to take both sides. Oh, the again. Yes, you're on no, the fence again. No, She should have gotten away and never got caught. Okay. And fuck it's like... That yeah. Fuck that yeah. shit. Yeah. You finally chose a side! You finally! Yeah, finally! Finally, you chose a side! No! Stupid her! She was stupid! She was stupid! She should have gotten away with it! Four million! You're a security guard! You no, earn like 10,000, 9,000, or sometimes five or six thousand! And you got away with four million rands! But I've got my own theories though. Watch. I think. So she got caught in Soweto. In Soweto. From her, her mom's house, house is in Soweto. Who steals? And then goes back to their mother's house. Who is smart enough to Aye. steal? That's why I say, thank God she got caught then. Yeah, she was dumb though. Cause, but I've got my theories. Who steals four million? Or smart enough to disappear with a heavily guarded four million? Hmm. And then goes back home and gets caught in Soweto. Sure. Right? I think either she got robbed because you're in Soweto, firstly. Mm. And I mean, come on, this is any hood from mm. Cape Town to mm. Forster to Soweto. Sure. There's guys who bomb ATMs there. There's guys who rob serious, you know, like yeah. mm. perform serious crimes. Mm. And someone who knows someone who knows someone. I mean, I know a bank robber from Forslo. Yeah. I know a bank robber, an ATM bomber, right? Mm, mm. Someone knows you and you got four million in your, your mom's house. I know or one from in Alex. In a back room. Mm. Exactly. Yeah, yeah. They'll find you. So I think she was robbed. Mm. And that, then she couldn't now move around. Because mm. you can disappear with four million, bro. People mm. disappear with a salary. Yeah. Mm. You get paid, disappear f- from home for four days. Mm. Oh. You know what I mean? People disappear for a week. For a week. They disappear in December and come Put back. December bonus for a yeah. week. Imagine if four million can disappear. <gasps> or my second theory is, she didn't steal four million. Mm. Maybe it was a, a million. Mm. But now the company knows if they say she stole four million, the public will literally help them look for her because someone to rob her some want to just snitch because mm. black people are like that, mm. right? Mm. So I think she did not steal four million. It was way less. And the money, four million would think you can disappear with it. And she couldn't disappear. Mm. That's my... Because no one is stupid to steal four million and stay in the hood you grew up with people who know you. Yeah. Mm. But then again, black people have the mentality of, I want to show them. Oh, them. Yes. You know, like yeah. the guys, one of those guys got caught from Oratambo Heist. Mm. Yeah. They stole like a couple of millions. Yeah. The next thing was in his hood, splashing, <laughs> buying Lamborghinis. Like, oh, dude. Yo. You know what I mean? Because you want to show those people mm. who said you were nothing. Mm. You're just a security guard with a great C or whatever <laughs> fucking certificate from Sira. Mm. Now she wants to show them mm. and she got caught. So that's my theory. I think either she didn't steal four million, they embellished it and said that's four million. 
when it was a million or she got robbed otherwise how, how can you stay in Soweto with four million yeah. with the people you grew up around all the company yeah. said disappointed if, if you put on that thing that um, they, they, they claimed that it was four million when it wasn't maybe it was also just to get more money from the insurance yeah. they do that I heard they do that mm. yes actually mm. so maybe it was just like half a million are you guys doing the Mlando challenge please guys ah, I'm dog. appreciating I appreciate no, every video man. that I'm I'm a flexi, bro. I can't do it, like, you know, like... Ah, just try. Just just move a hip So what's hand. the challenge? What do you do, like... It's I saw dancing. Skeeter doing it. It looked weird. Hi, hi. He's just enjoying TikTok. Don't worry. Don't don't mind him. Don't mind him. I love this. Oh, shout out to Skeeter. People love that oh, episode, Oh, I loved it, too. Oh, yeah, oh, Skeeter. Yeah. Like, people love that yeah. episode. It landed, eh? Yeah. We could have gone on for another three hours. That guy's got stories for yeah. days. He's such a good storyteller. Oh. Yes, yes, oh, yes. Man. For days, he's got stories. The one that kills me is when he pissed on the plane. Remember I told That's you guys, you thought I was lying. That was Funny, I was like, I could see that piss. Hey, <laughs> he was a rebel and a half, man. I was scared to live, bro. So you're not and doing Blando challenge? Um, no, nah, nah. Just for another week. It will. It's still a lovely, like to see. I'm just for it. I'm here to. Why do people do me. challenges? I've never done a challenge. I've never just seen. The need. Do it. No, do I've it. never seen the need. Why the fuck would you do a challenge? Uh, it's like, what, okay, what do you gain? Views man. on TikTok. It's not even about Literally. views. Sometimes it's just the community thing of like seeing one another person like do something that you did. So it just becomes fun. Yeah, and I've started a challenge. You remember the um, the Senzo, not Senzo's dad. Mm-hmm. You don't remember the challenge of people who were like out the window. Oh yeah, yes, 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 yes. I started that. You don't you remember? Yes, yeah, you when, started it. When Senzo's passed away, and then at the Senzo Miyua funeral, the dad was out there greeting yeah. people like he's arriving at an award show, yeah. and he's the one, the most nominated artist there, yeah. and he was like, "Hey, being a celebrity, I did that thing." I was at a car wash the following morning. I, not Senzo's dad, <laughs> and everybody did. I started that challenge. Oh nice. How did you start it? Um, it's something stupid you wanted. To, I wanted to do. So you started on TikTok. No. no, no, this was like 20... Probably on Facebook, no? 20, four, 15, 16. So what did you do? You went and posted like this? Yeah, yes. I, I, I went and posted like this, off, like outside of the window of my car. And I asked one of the people at the car wash to take a picture of me. Then I, I said, hashtag not send those dad. And mm-hmm. it, trended. it trended. So you were the first one? First ever. After, after send those dad. How sure are you, bro? What do you mean how sure I am? How many of us will sit and say not send those... <laughs> How many of us will sit and, and hashtag not send those dad and post like I'm the first one and then Sea Life did it, Fistas Mixwell did it. Those were the first few people who did it. It picked up. I was the first one. Who but you had like hundred followers that time. Nah, I had like hundred and ten thousand followers, but I bought like fifty thousand of them. And then I had like, <laughs> then I had like so I had I sixty thousand followers. Oh, that was enough to get it oh, done. Oh, yeah. okay. That was enough to get it done. Yeah, yeah, mm. yeah. Okay. Uh, I just googled why do people do challenges. Uh, the popularity of viral challenges speaks to our inherent desire to fit in mm-hmm. and fit and feel part of it's something community. larger than ourselves. Yeah. Not now. Now experts, maybe. Experts say teenagers may be especially sub... This is where I need Unati. Susceptible. You are susceptible. susceptible. To trying risky stunts because their brain's decision-making center is still developing. Mm. You see... So what do you, what are they saying about Husky? <laughs> <laughs> no, <laughs> he listens to his daughters, the teenage daughters, too much. That, that's maybe the brain is still developing. <laughs> He's <laughs> 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 susceptible. <laughs> He's influenced by his daughter, by kids. That's why he ends up doing this. Susceptible Mm -hmm. to trying risky stunts. (laughs) (laughs) Okay. (laughs) But that is risky. That Mlalo challenge is risky for Skiro. No, he was doing it from top floor. He was doing top floor. Yeah, true. What if he falls? That's very risky, (laughs) dogs. Weren't they no rails or something? (laughs) Because you see people hanging on trees. Bro, there should be an age limit to these things, man. (laughs) (laughs) Cut off 60 years old. Wow. <laughs> 60 is a cutoff. <laughs> <laughs> this is why it trains, right? They ain't gonna blame me. It's hard always. It's hard. I'm telling you, man. 
Anyway, we'll cut that part out, eh? <laughs> nah, Mesh, leave it in. <laughs> leave it in, man. Now I don't want to take offense to that. Nah, nah, no, no. I don't think the short man will, yeah. Yeah, that's what you want to talk about, right? Uh, do you believe in these things of taking like a fast before the year starts so that like your things be proper? Have you done that? No, 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 no. Kanyako is not having sex, not eating meat, oh, not really? doing. Um, it's the Daniel fast that she's doing, ne? The the Daniel fast. Oh, it's called a Daniel. Yeah, twenty one day specific. I think it's a, there's a Daniel twenty one. Oh, day like fast. Daniel in the Bible did yes, that. Yes, yes. Oh, da- yeah. and, and it works apparently. Mm. Well, she's driving around in Cape Town with Ferraris and stuff. Mm. Apparently, Mesh is also on the twenty one day fast. What do you mean he came late f- for the show? Was at a woman's place? <laughs> <laughs> what do you but mean? He, he had no you're sex. Doing the Daniel fast. You had no sex though, right? What do you mean you had no sex? Oh, he had roadkill. <laughs> oh. <laughs> no. Ah, yeah. no, no, no. That was in December. It was before the fast. Okay. Yeah. So she's fasting? I want to try those things. Yeah. Well, I'm late now. I don't know if we can start now. No, I'm not late. Hey, I haven't, had, yeah, I haven't had sex this year. No, I'm not late. I can actually start now. Yeah, Bob. <laughs> yeah, I'll start now. <laughs> I'll start now. I'll start now. <laughs> I used to believe, like, I used to, I used to fast like a lot, but then until I kind of like fasting is for yourself. You know how people do it for things, and I, I don't like to attain stuff, and it's just purely for yourself. Yes, yeah, like what Israel said: don't have sex if you want some a big, that big contract. So you don't believe in that. Yeah, you don't subscribe to that. Yes. So what's LKG doing? She's not having sex. Yeah, and her husband Eating said him was in gala. <laughs> which, which, so the irony, right? And now, he's on the, he's on the Hunger Games. Oh, so now he needs to find a different home where it was a was in gala <laughs> for someone else. Because <laughs> the wife, you're gala. Like, what the flip are you doing? <laughs> so she's not having sex. Alcohol. No alcohol. No, alcohol. no meat. For no 21 meat. days. Wow. 21 days. And and obviously, to attain prosperity, wisdom, growth, and clarity throughout the year. And yeah. I respect for, like, it takes discipline to do that. Shout out. You better, it better have results, you know, mm. if you want to. But she's got everything she needs, man. What, what more she, she's yeah. fasting for? But she does because maybe she does that every year. Oh, yes. Yes. And it's what, you see, it's, it's working. working. Yeah. You know what I mean? It's like, yeah. you can see the results. Yeah. You know what I mean? I can fast it's in like July. When you, and like from the moment I wake up, but let's say I'll break the fast like off I- in the evening for supper. So for me, a fast can just be a one day. Sometimes, <laughs> yes. when are you, <laughs> are you it's, a, it's just a fast thing for you. <laughs> it's just like, the thing will be lasting one minute. It's just a fast thing for you. <laughs> it's just a fast <laughs> thing. The thing goes, <laughs> <laughs> it's done. <laughs> Uh, that's not fasting, goes lady. That's fuck out of here. That's a fasting. I've been fasting since last night, then. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. 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 No, no, yeah. But you must be conscious about it. <laughs> not about that. Not, uh, not that you just. You don't. I've been gonna fast for days. <laughs> not the fasting a few hours. I know it's intermittent fasting or whatever, but I think that just works for weight. I don't. Or, or, or nutritionally for the yes. body. I don't think it works for like spiritually fasting. No, for like but 12 it can. Hours. It can work for sp- spiritually. If it's like something, I just wanna pray. Like I just wanna be in prayer today and just like. I've, like, because the thing is, you deprive yourself from things that you like. So that's what fasting is. So it can be one day, it can be two days, it could be a week, it could be 21 days. Now, that's not different, guys. It's not only that you have to do a 21 day in order to now achieve what Lerato or has. Uh-uh. But depriving your body of something does it not mean nothing if it's just for 12 hours? Because there's no pain and no pain, no gain, right? There's no pain in 12 hours of, na- of something you have every day. Shouldn't it be you straightening yourself and actually feeling the deprivation? So you got to feel pain. Yeah. No. Oh, that so, means I can't it's, like, it's like you, can't, you won't no. see results if you work out for, two, uh, for 30 minutes every day. As opposed to if you work out for f- two hours and you start feeling your body saying no and you push yourself. But that means I can't fast because I've got so much pain. I gotta have trauma. <laughs> <laughs> I've got too much trauma. Wow. <laughs> no, your kind of trauma doesn't need fasting. It needs counseling. <laughs> 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 Uh, but I think to be effective, you need to do it longer. Go, no, you can't fast no, for six hours. No, because then I think that's when you're not starting to kind of manipulate 
the energy or whatever if let's say you're trusting something you're trusting God for something now you're going to starve yourself for 21 days yeah but it I can be a day of, uh, no. No, then I was no but if you you know you used to like I like to have breakfast at 9 and I want to have, have a snack at 12 and something and then I decide you know what I'm only it's just about prayer today and I'll then, break my fast at maybe like 5 p.m. Then it's like fine. No, you can achieve it. No, but Daniel, how how long did Daniel go for in the Bible? Then that's why we don't have to be like Daniel, guys. There's different people. How many people are there in the Bible? Did they all fast? Exactly. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, speaking about Daniel, please tell me what you're telling me in the car now about Bolt. Oh, oh that shit is funny. Bolt. <laughs> Uber. That shit is funny. Yeah. There was there was trending that if you change your name like to a white name on either your um, Uber or Bolt, they actually the prices are lower. <laughs> Oh, oh, imagine, wow. imagine. <laughs> so people are out here being Thunder Mavers and being Smith and being, you know. Nah, that's BS. I call, I call yeah. BS. It was trending on, I was like, whoa, I checked BS. it out. Try it, man. You use balls. Try Sol Thunder Merver. Not even Sol. Try like Nick Carl. Van Thunder. Carl. Carl. Carl, Carl um. Matthias. Hmm. <laughs> oh Wayne, Wayne. He's giving me all the callers from nine four seven. morning, we're rocking the girl. What's going on? <laughs> on nine four seven. If you love us, we love you. Call the Dias. <laughs> what the fuck, man? <laughs> it's those surnames. I'll, I'll try Carl McMillan rather. Okay, yeah. <laughs> Proper yeah. English. <laughs> so try it. I, I don't know. Like I was like, for real? Yeah. Ah, nah. Anyway. Nah, I Stop. think that works with like hotel reservations where you, um, in restaurants where you try to book, but Uber, the, the crazy algorithm for that. Nah. Anyway, we're counting down to our Valentine's Speed Dating Party, Yay. 13th of Feb. Uh, whether you are uh, straight, uh, gay, lesbian, uh, whatever, yeah. come yeah. through, man. If what you're single, yeah, if yeah, you're come single, through. come through. Valentine's Day Speed Dating Party happening on the 13th of Feb. Uh, if you want tickets, check in. Below. How do I secure do. my spot if like I'm single and horny and wanna rock and roll? Hey man, you'll find out on the day. And no man. Also, people wanted to ask. There were some Wait. some some questions that we we're getting. Is this going to be on YouTube? Is this gonna be recorded? I think it's people Mesh. who've got somebody, but they wanna come. Mesh so wants it to be recorded. He wants to do like a. He wants to record the whole thing, ne? Yeah. Oh, Mesh. Oh. Yeah. He Wait. Wants to record so the whole there are thing. people that can't now come because ish. Makwa pennies. Yeah. Uh, they want you to partake, but I guess they they don't I, want to. Who wants to partake? Like no. side chicks and side niggas. Yeah. Side chicks of who? I of don't know. Yeah, what do you think? Yeah, yeah. No, no, like no. I'm just saying there were someone. a lot of inquiries that people were saying, <coughs> is it going to be recorded? Like, oh, so some. There's two. Wait, wait. Oh. Give them a mic. Can someone speak and elaborate? So ghost, I'm confused, yeah, give them the mic. So you're saying, ghosty. That there's people who are inquiring if it's gonna who be are inquiring if will their boyfriend see if they wanna come if yes. they come through or their girlfriend see, see. Ah. If they, yeah it's people like that okay wait man mm. so if I wanna come yes. I must just come on the day there's no application no you no have there to. is that's why you have to click below yes. and what podcast are you listening to oh yes no I want you to reiterate that because someone asked me and I was lost also you know no you click in the description. And you There's apply, you put a selfie. Yeah, so in the dis- dis- <laughs> <laughs> the description, description below. Yes, there's a link. Oh. Howler.co.za. Mm-hmm. You click on that link mm-hmm. and then you pay 50 bucks. Mm-hmm. That's you applying. And then you describe if you're a male, female or whatever, other gender, whatever. Mm-hmm. And then that's it. We don't see the person. No, you don't see the person. No, mm. We'll see the person on the day. On the day. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so there's only 100 spots, 50 women, 50 male. I feel like we should have increased. It shouldn't have been fifty bucks. I feel like by making it higher, we somehow it's a quality control thing. In my head, it feels like that. that doesn't it feel like that? I feel like fifty bucks. Hey, who won't get one? Anyone can just enter. I feel like the quality is roadkill. I feel like it's roadkill, man. I feel like we should have said five hundred includes a buffet or some nice things and drinks and a picture with Saul and Mac. Can you know, like, I feel like it's gonna be, hey, but let's hope not. Because last time we did it, there were eighty percent of the people were ladies. 
So eventually, like, uh, Len had to take part, Tabang had to take part, <laughs> Naga had to take part. Oh, that's fun. I had to that's, take part. Oh, that sounds like fun. Because there were not, not enough yeah. niggas. There were too many women. Yeah, that's, yeah, generally. Everyone yeah. had It's to. like that, generally. Yeah. yeah. And there was one person from the LGBTI community. Yes. Ah, who wanted oh. Naga. And they had fun. Oh, oh. Sure. <laughs> you wanted Naga. High and low. For real? High and low. Well, mostly low. <laughs> You see, so <laughs> <laughs> you're saying, Mesh. Uh, there's too many people, so we're not gonna record everything. It's just gonna be a selected number of people that are gonna be recorded. So if you want to be on camera, you can be. If you don't want to be, uh, oh, fine. so ah. it's gonna be like all you need is love. Yeah, like uh, select. You know, do you even know all you need is love? You weren't born then. How? Nah, nah, nah. <laughs> all you need. Is yeah, the it's show. A one. Yeah, yeah, we'll stop at another. Yeah, stop at another. Yeah, yeah, and get on it, uncle. No, all you need is love. You remember that promo? Get nani okay. I remember all you need is love. Yes. Yeah, so not everyone's going to be recorded. Obviously, quality control, you know, nice faces must be on camera, no road kill. Hey, don't uh, nice no road kill? Uh, Who are you to say that? Uh, hey, uh, nigga. Uh, nigga. Uh, road talk. Uh, so, <laughs> so, yeah, not everyone, so, not everyone so, will, will be recorded. Okay, so everyone will be, but if you have a boyfriend, or a girlfriend, you will just alert the guys to say, "Don't show my face; it'll compromise." <laughs> Look at That's us mm. Mm. promoting yeah. cheating. Just mash, remove this one. How? And then don't In show. Ah. Perfect. I get it. Does mesh ever remove? <laughs> okay. No, but this time you must remove. <laughs> <laughs> this time you must remove. Under strict instructions. Under strict orders. <laughs> from the oh, boss. <laughs> Mac G signed. Mac G. <laughs> Please. Sign with trauma. Yeah. Mac G. <laughs> <laughs> Motherfucker. <laughs> 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 Please remove mesh. Don't compromise the chillers, man. Don't hey, we out here, man. Make sure you subscribe to our second channel. <laughs> if you don't want to watch like the whole episode, yeah. they've got we've got another channel for snippets, like oh. ten minutes. Do a Q and A. We were meant to do a Q and A today, but I think we're out of time. We'll do it next week. Okay. Yeah, because the questions aren't going anywhere, so okay. we can answer them next week. Oh yeah. We'll do our first Q and A next week. Nice. And then also make sure you subscribe to our second channel. The link is here. Uh, that's for snippets. If you want snippets from all our celebrity interviews mm. you can check them out there make sure you check out chillers market if you're a chiller and you have a business check out chillersmarket.com yes upload your business there subscribe and let's support each other man there's so much going on in chillers market it's amazing it's fucking crazy yeah. i still haven't yeah, seen your wild. company I, I haven't seen your company yeah it's coming is it coming yeah it's what's coming. what's the what's the hold up um, you don't have a logo it's <laughs> please come on man it's coming man it's coming <laughs> The Q and A. So the Q and A is for Patreons. No, we'll do the Q and A. No, it's for 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 the normal show. Oh, dope. Yeah. So what I did is I asked our members and Patreons to send us questions. Questions. So we're meant to do it now, but we're out of time. So oh, we'll so everybody week. will get to see it. But the only people with the privilege of asking the questions, questions. is Patreons and members. Yeah. Beautiful. Yeah. So if nice. you want to be a Patreon, subscribe, <laughs> click, support the channel, and a member as well on YouTube. What else am I living out? Why do people You're always asking anything. me when they're getting their merch? Bro, I get so many emails. Like, It's crazy. We so there's a, on the website, there's a process and it says the turnaround time there and the WhatsApp number to ask any queries, right? I don't know if it's not showing because sure. I don't buy the merch online, for sure, for sure. right? But normally there's an email that gets sent out immediately. And sometimes if you'd noticed and on the WhatsApp line, people will send screenshot of that message and sure. it says receipt, order number. This is what you bought. This is how much you paid at this address. That turnaround time seven to fourteen working okay. days, and there's a number for the WhatsApp. So when people say I have no communication, not received any communication, I don't know what's happening. Okay, and like one or two people have said that, and I asked the website maintenance guy. The maintenance guy said no, the emails are still getting sent because he did a, a dummy purchase. We got, we got a maintenance guy, guy. Yeah. We got an IT guy. Round of applause. Yo. Which podcast you know that has an IT guy? guy. The, IT guy. guy. The, IT guy. the web maintenance department. Yo! <laughs> which, which one? Yay. Who's yeah. this one? Yeah! Yeah! yeah. Yay. yeah. IT! Yeah. So I don't know what's up with that. We got a driver! Yay! Oh shit, we got a driver? We got, got a driver, driver guys. Oh, yeah. 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 Yes. What else we got? We got a lawyer. Oh, yeah. We got a lawyer. We got a lawyer. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We yes. got a lawyer. We got a lawyer. Yes. We got a lawyer. Yeah. yeah. We got, got, got an accountant. We got, got an accountant. Funo. 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 Funo.
Jesus Christ, <laughs> mesh. Can I get a yeah? <laughs> you got roadkill. <laughs> and they tasty. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And they're nice. And they're lovely. Uh, yeah, <laughs> oh, oh man, we are here. This has been awesome. Before, Podcast and chill. <laughs> Remember, we wanted to just talk about the whole Seho, like the update on he, um, the police. How far is What is, oh, yes. Oh, what yes, is, yes. Blackie, Blackie. Blackie. What Blackie. is Blackie. happening, guys? Blackie got murdered. What's going on with the case, friends of Blackie? We're all friends of Blackie, but you know, Maligant. Mm, uh, Have you guys up, uh, checked out what's going on with the case? Because we need answers, bro. Yeah, man. I know and, South and, Africa and wanted what can a we do high homicide rates, but a, 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 someone can't just get murdered. No, give it to now. Give it to now. Give it to now. I say, Pierre, I mean, what's happening Pierre now? Needs to be um, so far, countable. Uh, there isn't really solid com- uh, communication from the police Ish. you know because they are the ones who are liaising with the family mm. um i think uh, there was this other time it was during december i think tato got a call from uh Tseho's brother mm. who said that and then tato asked about the case and then who said that actually the detective who was handling the case uh now went to quarantine because Ish. of um COVID. COVID and everything mm. But I was I was I was like okay but how 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 is that possible mm. means that only one detective is in charge of the case what oh, about yes. his deputy. assistant or yeah deputy yeah. I don't I don't understand so that that was actually the last communication that we got from that cuz from my understanding there is so um the story someone scratched the car like he was driving Blackie chased after these guys and it was not his car and he took a video to say to tell the car owner listen this is the car that has scratched me i'm sure. running after them mm. and the guy was like ah just leave it just leave it but so there's video footage because he did send the video footage mm. to, to that guy, guy. Yeah. so we've got a plate mm. yes. we've got a number plate and from a number plate you've got an owner mm. and apparently these guys have been implicated in other s- uh, crimes, crimes yeah, the, 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 yeah. the cops had been looking for them for yeah years. so how, how how is it difficult to just locate these guys guys yeah. That 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 was the first question that we had on the first day when we heard uh, from the guy, the, the the owner of the car, because he was he was at this police station on that day. And then they told him that actually these people are wanted for these murders and stuff like that. Jesus, but I was murders. like, but now sure. it means that I mean they got them in a silver platter now because exactly. now they have known criminals. Yeah, if because they have the number plates and you can check wh- who owns the car and everything like that. Well, the but fact now that they even even said. These are people who are lo- yeah, we've been looking yeah, for these know, people, and they've been failing. No, yeah. they mean they catch know who only to around catch. around the same place, which is Atrechville. Yeah. Mm. So I don't know. What could be so difficult? Nah, guys, justice for Blackie, man. We need to follow up, like seriously. Definitely. I think as a platform, we really need to follow it up. He's no. one of our own. He's one of our own, no. man. And you know, like the s- now, how many in the country get killed, and it's just a cold. Ki- the bloody captain of the national team got murdered. And with witnesses until today, there's no oh. case. You know what I mean? Like, we don't know who did it. It's so so with this one, we don't want the same thing happening. And no. how many sh- times does it happen to non-prominent people? Mm. You know, so please, justice for Blackie. I mean, the lady who got murdered, who's part of Drip Glenda, there's nothing on that case. Wow. Senzo Miyua, nothing. Blackie, nothing. And many other nameless people out there, nothing on their cases. Honestly speaking, someone needs to hold the SAPS fucking unaccountable. 100%. People yeah. can't die like flies in our own country and there's no, like, what the hell, man? Because that's going to motivate other people when they're angry in a fit of rage or they're committing crime to just easily kill a person because they can get away with it. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. We need Especially fucking answers. when there's evidence. No, nah, we need fucking answers. No man. way. Guys, we must, we must follow. I think as a team, we must fucking follow it up. Yeah, I know. That's depressing, man. Yeah, no, nah, man. We need answers. Uh, but anyway, on a lighter note, um, did the uh, ghost lady invite you to a watch party tonight? <sighs> yeah? We're watching Emmanuel <laughs> on oh. ETV. <laughs> <laughs> how, ima- how I didn't get the invite? Yeah. First, firstly, who's, who's also invited? I didn't get the manual. Eh? <laughs> <laughs> you get the memo? <laughs> For I get to bring back an accord. They might as well bring back Emmanuel. No, it's <laughs> 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 I tweeted them and I told them, yo, here's my Netflix logins, man, if you need any movies. I, for real, I tweeted them and I you said, yo, it. here's my Netflix logins, guys. It's <laughs> <Skates. laughs> <laughs> If you need any content just <laughs> screen record the whole thing and put on ETV like what's up with ETV man hey, hey, Tato it's like a Tato Mesh do you know Emmanuel yeah, 
You grew up, you grew up watching him, man. I didn't know that. Wait. It must have been like three years, dog. <laughs> How? <laughs> Wait, 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 give him the mic there. <laughs> I thought you never knew about Emmanuel. No Tata, one. do you know about Emmanuel? Yeah. And now you know about Emmanuel. Yeah, oh, hey, oh, these everyone. kids are wild. Yo, eh? dog, how old are you guys when you... Yo, weren't you asleep by then? <laughs> <laughs> when we were five, we struggled to stay up at, on, on New Year's Eve. Yeah. Okay, till midnight. How yeah. You know, sometimes we know of it, but we have never seen it. Because at school, other kids will, will talk about it. Emmanuel. Say, Emmanuel, Emmanuel, Emmanuel. But you won't... When was the first time Emmanuel was on A, bro? That's like 1990-something, bro. Nah, 2000s. Like 2000s. Ah, uh, 90s, because we we we're talking about in primary school, grade 6, and I was done in primary school 2001. It started with Anaconda. Anaconda was 1997, eh? The first... Like, but Anaconda yeah, was Ice Cube. Yeah. Ice Cube, yeah. So how old were you in 1997? Eh? No. One. one. Oh. So how do you know Emmanuel? Oh. <laughs> no. Some, some one, ba- one year old babies were okay, watching. Okay, but 2003. Three, yeah. You were, you were, you were, you were four. You were grade four. one. No, no, not four. Not four. You were seven. seven. You were seven. Watching when you heard Emmanuel. about Emmanuel? No, 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 when you started watching. You couldn't stay up to we one a.m. We knew we were 12. We were 12, Jack Hall. I gauge. You couldn't know. stay up. Yeah, I gauge. We were 12 in on Saturdays, Jack Hall. What do you remember about Emmanuel? There's a storyline. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, oh yes, it's, a, it's like a whole storyline, right? It's like the weirdest shit ever. It's a storyline. I just remember boobs. Breasts. No, it was a storyline that you'd go to the train or office or whatever, and then or the plumber would come to fix a pipe. There was a storyline. There was yeah. a storyline. There was a storyline. There wasn't like porn. It you was know? soft porn, dog. It was like soft porn. porn. It was soft porn. It was yeah, soft with porn. Yeah, storyline. Like with a storyline. I remember one uh, scene where there's a girl smoking cigarette from a pussy. Jesus. On Emmanuel. I heard that, but I never. Cigarette. I, cigarette. That was not Emmanuel, guys. Remember that brief, no. beautiful pussy you were talking about? Yeah, the one that was trending, yeah? Yeah, so imagine you put a cigarette inside the. The, 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 the lips. The lips. The, yes. And then yep. she was smoking the cigarette vulva. from the lips. Oh. On Emmanuel. It no. wasn't Emmanuel. Kaki guys, what in Emmanuel was I watching? No, you were watching this hardcore. Uh-huh. Yeah. <laughs> you were watching some hardcore porn. <laughs> yes. It's not even Emmanuel yeah. never even showed pussy. Because in, in Emmanuel, I was born quiet. Yes. <laughs> you don't see it. Exactly. So bad, not be quiet. Yeah. yeah. I got trauma, guys. Uh, <laughs> yes. Hey, who's <laughs> Emmanuel? Who you watching? Oh, yeah, but... Yay! Yeah. Where there's pussy. Emmanuel never showed pussy. Like, yeah. Ow. It was just boobs and obviously her naked and it's just like... But and soft th- porn. And yes. socks. Yes, yeah. it was soft porn. Yes. Yeah. yeah, so the soft core. It was nothing. <laughs> it was nothing <laughs> like hardcore, opening legs core. and mm. seeing things. No, guys. Uh-uh. Hey, but hey, those were good days, eh? But I remember someone talking, yeah. telling about there was some scene. And apparently, that made like money for this, like the ETV, ETV. ETV. How did they oh. get away with it, bro? Uh, wow. No, it's watershed. Remember, it's like the same thing on radio. Mm. You can say, you can talk about sex, pussy, at like one. You would know you the graveyard. No, they made sure they never told me about watershed. This is Carl. Yeah. What is it? So you could you get away with 18 plus content uh, at that t- those times. Like I think it's like midnight to like 5 a.m. or something. Uh, let's hashtag bring back Emmanuel. <laughs> to yes. Win. Bring back Emmanuel. Yes. Hashtag bring, bring back, back Emmanuel. Emmanuel. Okay. Ziggy's five. He needs to see it. Uh, no. <laughs> <laughs> but Ziggy grows up with a father, so you can tell him about it. <laughs> He doesn't have like need to the right be raised way. by Emmanuel and Tupac. Exactly. <laughs> you know, you can tell Ziggy about these things. That son, you can smoke from a pussy, you know. Ah. But let's you know first talk about smoking. Smoke, right? Let's first talk about smoking. Ah. <laughs> so, you know I mean, a pussy can smoke, right? <laughs> yeah, you know, right? A pussy can smoke, right? You know, right? So, guys, you mean Anaconda played with, like, adverts? Yes. Yeah. Sure. I think that's what you they're You mean selling. these days... This day and age, ETV plays Anaconda with adverts, and yeah. people sit there and watch. Yeah. yeah, you know why? Because apparently the ratings oh. have been high for Anaconda. Like, funny enough, like the ratings are high, so that's why they keep bringing it back. I saw that tweet by Phil and Pella saying that. So Channel O should keep playing our podcast then. They will. Oh mm. yeah, mm. on repeat. They will. On repeat. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. Especially Jup Jup. Eh? <laughs> I play Jup Jup from Monday to Friday. Hey Jup Jup. <laughs> So wait, is Jujub really gone from um thingy? No. Nah, yeah, Chola. Nah, Much I love. I don't think so. No. Yeah, ways. they pulled him off. Like, yeah, well, he's not. He's not yeah, he's not on his. Who, who can do that job better than Jujub? No, they said he was suspended, dog. Yeah, but it's still is he back on now? 
Ah, he'll come back. There's no way. Ah, you never Dog, know. Dog, they can suspend you permanently. permanently. No, there's no actual line without that Jup Jup. No, yeah, there's no actual line. No, no, like, there's, there's that, that other thing. guy. The other guy, I love the other guy who, who? also does uh, Chola. And who? Who's no, the other guy? No, what's his name? The one at the start. The other? beginning. Because in the beginning, there was Dr. Lab, Dr. Kukwete. No, no, not, not him. Oh, no, not Kukwete. No, there's oh, another the one. The thin guy. The thin guy. Nah. No, I love that guy. Uh, nah. Yeah, Jube, it's there's seasoned. a reason why Jup Jup is always the no. guy, like the prominent guy. No, no, no. one can no. do better than him. Yeah. Right. Exactly. Okay, so we are here podcasting chill. Boom. Boom. Peace. Inga. <laughs> 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 <laughs>